Is that how we do it? Okay, I think it's working now. Okay. I think it's working. Hey, there we go. Jesus, dude. I swear, there we go. Evening, fellas. That should be working. I think. Is it? Oh my god, dude. Is it working? Are we good? I'm okay, right. There we go. I can see the chat. I think it's working. Are we live? Right, okay. Let me, uh, oh, right, there we go. I can see the chat coming in. Right, okay, thank God. I swear, chat, YouTube, they love changing the UIs for no reason, like, uh, just randomly. I, <laughs> Jesus, man, I don't understand how YouTube can function. Anyway, enough of that garbage. Let's play some Halo 2, because it's finally out on PC. And I'm hearing bad things. Um, hello, Late Night Gaming. Hello, my friend. Welcome to the stream with the, with the most technical difficulties in existence. Um, right. Let's, uh, let's just start and hope the internet doesn't crash or the game doesn't crash or YouTube doesn't crash. Yeah, I've not heard good things about this port. I've not heard good things at all. So let's, let's test it out. Um... Fingers crossed it actually works. Oh yeah, this cutscene. <laughs> Forgot about this. Do not trust you. Thank you for the two bucks, Chris Russell. Oh, actually, hang on. But I do not. Let me real quick. Uh... No. My friends trust. There we go. Not the issue. Oh, skipped it. All right. Okay, let's restart it. Oh. Okay. <laughs> right, we're starting that again. We're starting that again. I don't know why that skipped the cutscene. I need a weapon. There we go. Okay, they're showing it now. I didn't want to uh, have people's donations that showed up on the screen. Let me restart. Okay, right. Let's watch that cutscene again that doesn't mean anything anymore because it was kind of irrelevant by the time Halo 5 came out. <laughs> the less reminders that H-Rap happened, the better. Hey, Gamma36, thanks to 15 bucks, dude. Do you prefer Storm Rifle or Plasma Repeater? Uh, Plasma Repeater, I think. I'm, I'm not particularly a massive fan of either. But the Plasma Repeater looks more like a Covenant weapon to me I than a rifle. God, these elites look so good, dude. You may, but I, do not. Oh, I love how these no. sort of thing here, these elites My worked. This cutscene baited me so hard with Halo 5. It is my trust. Who's next? That's what you get when you mess with a Spartan. You are a hunter, yes. A seeker. A seeker of things. A strange way to describe him. And now you hunt other Spartans. I'm not so much hunting a Spartan. Oh, God. This gives me... This this just annoys me watching this because I love everything in this so much. One, one, seven. I was not told the identity of That is why I'm sharing it with you now. We're talking about... It crashed. What? Oh, my... Dude, what the yeah, fuck? Your people used to call Is it are we live? Was that an insult? I need a comment? weapon. An insult to be sure. But one with a modicum of respect. He was in Are we live? I don't even But in time. I named him Ally. Why is the script The events which bore Are we back? I need a Come. weapon. Oh dude, YouTube streaming makes you wanna fucking put a bullet in my skull. It's so, 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 so bad. <laughs> I need a weapon. Thank you for the five bucks. I missed that one. Oh my, this is... Everything is going wrong. Everything is going wrong, bro. <laughs> I kicked you all off and you had to rejoin. Fucking hell. I need a weapon. I'm missing so many things. Hang on. Will I play an anniversary or old? A mixture of the two. One. Campaign works great. Anniversary multiplayer sure? was bad though. I've heard that as well. Thank you for the five bucks spilling cookies. And also You're Ultimate Cree Gamer. Why was it not destroyed? The fleet. It fled as we set fire to their planet. I need a I followed with all the ships in my command. Thanks to two bucks, Chris Russell. Uh, when AR. Definitely. Halo, were you blinded by its majesty? I was indeed. I need a weapon. Dumbstruck? No. 
Yet the humans were able to Tax there, thanks for the fight, dude. <laughs> Hope your family are well. <laughs> never, my dude, never. Thank you very much, there. I appreciate it, dude. Definitely never. Always good to see you in here, man. There will be order in this council. You were right to focus your I need a weapon. But this demon, this master chief. By the time I learned the demon's intent, it was already too late. There was nothing I could do. Noble prophet of truth, this has gone on long enough. Make an example of this. Bungle. Make an example of this bungle. Council demands it. You are one of our most treasured instruments. Oh, the stream's not died again, has it? Led your fleet with honor <laughs> and distinction. But Every goddamn stream, dude. <laughs> To safeguard Halo was a colossal failure. Nay, it was heresy. I will continue my campaign against the humans. No, no, you will not. You will not. Okay, stream's working. At least that's good. Soon the great journey shall begin. But when it does, the weight of your heresy will stay your feet, and you shall be left behind. Or will you? Hmm. What the fuck, Druid? YouTube is... It's, I'm sorry, it's a shit platform. <laughs> it's a... The, the platform is, like, put together with fucking duct tape. <laughs> Optics totally fried, and let's not even talk about the power. Supply. Look at that hairline. You know how expensive this gear is, son. Tell that to the covenant. <laughs> Can't beat one liner, chief. Normal difficulty. I'm doing these on YouTube purely because I mean it, it's Halo, and I, I like doing Halo stuff over here. Well, primarily. I guess it was all obsolete anyway. Your new suit's a Mark VI. Just came up from Songnam this morning. Try and take it easy until you get used Korean to Korean-made armor. Okay, let's test your targeting first thing. Let's test your targeting look first thing. Light. Good. Now look at the bottom light. All right. Look and at look the, the top, top light again. That's All right, it. Said, now, now the, the bottom, bottom one. Okay. Everything checks out. It does Stand indeed. By. I do not I'm need inverted. I need a weapon. Stephen Mikey, thanks for the five bucks, dude. Let's all hope the design got infected and unclad. Yeah, hopefully not. Hopefully not. Hopefully the stream doesn't get infected. Fingers crossed. I mean, I won't. I won't put it past it at this point. Quite honestly. So thank you for the five bucks, dude. I appreciate it. This station will test your recharging energy shields. Your new armor shields are extremely resilient. Very extremely resilient. I need a weapon. Bingo. As you can see, they recharge a lot faster. A lot faster. If your shields go down, find some right, let's push guns into. Let's push him into the elevator. You coming with us, guns? You done with my boy here, Look at that hairline. I don't see any training wheels. His armor's working fine, Johnson. So shut your chilly hole. Shut your chilly hole. You're free to go, son. Just remember, take things slow. Don't worry, I'll hold his hand. All right, come on, come on, guns. You coming with us? You coming with us, son? Oh, okay. Oh, I thought he was about to walk in there then. Come on, Chief. They're ready for us on the bridge. Come on, Guns. They're ready for us on the bridge. Come on, Guns. Get on the lift, Chief. We're gonna be late. Oh, you know what? Guns is that enough? He's, he's oh, not. Jones, he's not coming. He's not invited. Tell me how you made it back home in one piece. Sorry, Guns. <laughs> it's classified. Huh. <laughs> My ass. Well, you can forget about those adjustments to your A2 scope. What adjustments did Johnson well, want to his BR scope? Maybe Lord Hood didn't give him an invitation. An invitation. Look at that majestic skybox and really bad texture popping. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> Lovely. Haven't seen it in years. Haven't seen it in years. This skybox looks so good though. When Walking I by myself. Thanks for the five bucks, dude. One of these coins is carrying it for the supercell. <laughs> I'll leave more behind then. Thank you very much, dude. I need a weapon. It is quite majestic. It is a very majestic looking place, to be fair. Fire from the Athens and the Malta. Hey, thank you, Mikey. Thanks for the five bucks, dude. I appreciate it. Thank you for the kind words. 
Yeah. These defender screens look so cool. Nobody's saying much, but I think something big's about to happen. <gasps> something big. You, you're kind of right, you know, Jonathan. You are right in a way. I mean, something big is about to happen, just not in the way that you, you'd like it to. What if I just stand here awkwardly? <laughs> oh, I thought it was just going to sit there. I need a weapon. Nah, we're not doing legendary today. Fuck no. I do want to try and do a legendary stream at some point, just to see how far we get before I want to top myself. But for now, we're doing normal. You told me there wouldn't be any cameras. And you told me you were going to wear something nice. Folks need heroes. I don't know. Mark 6 looks pretty nice to me. So smile, would you? Well, we still got something to smile about. Would it help if you said please? Maybe. I probably should have said please. Thanks to TD, I appreciate it. I love how juxtaposed, juxta, juxtaposed, ju I can't fucking pronounce shit today. These, uh, these two cutscenes are, they look so good. Hey, Gamma, thanks for the 10 bucks, dude. Imagine a grave mine with legs. Just two bipedal legs walking about. That is quite a, I need a weapon. quite a thought. Thank you for the 10 bucks, dude. I appreciate it. I love the, how these cutscenes are put together so well. It's, oh, dude, it's so good. I need a weapon. If they came to hear, hear me beg, they will be disappointed. Iconic line. That is iconic. When's the first non-Halo video coming? Yep, not sure. Um, working on a pretty big Halo video right now, so it's going to be soon, but not. I'm not sure when. Do I like milk? Yes, I do. Stephen Mickey, thank you. Thanks for two bucks, dude. Can we get another ASMR what, what, what? What, what, what? How about that? Gentlemen, <laughs> we're lucky to have you back. Appreciate it, man. Go ahead, Cortana. Uh-oh. Another whisper, sir, near Io. We have probes in I need a weapon. I apologize, but we're going to have to make this quick. You look nice. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Sergeant Major, Colonial Cross. <laughs> Little things like that. Acts of singular daring and devotion. Hey, Jay Burrow, thanks for the 10 bucks, dude. United Earth Has the slight change of chief sum between Halo 2 and 3 ever been explained? No, nah, it's just sort of like autistic license, I think. Uh, pretty much that. And damage a little bit. Thanks for the 10 bucks there, dude. I appreciate it. Yeah, the way, the, the way those two cutscenes are juxtaposed is so cool. Complete, like, diametrically opposed stories. Military service. His bravery in the face of impossible odds reflects great credit upon himself and the UNSC. The Navy has lost one of its best. It's going to sound really weird, but I always thought that Miranda's face in H2A looked a bit like it was melting. <laughs> I know that sounds really weird. <laughs> it kind of does, though. Hey, Kuno, thanks for the 100, dude. Locke sucks. I hope he doesn't return in Infinite. He wasn't great in Halo 5, I'll give you that. Oh! God, these cutscenes look so fucking good, dude. Fifteen Covenant capital ships holding position I need just a outside weapon. the kill zone. This is Fleet Admiral Harper. We are engaging the enemy. Negative, Admiral. Form a defensive perimeter around the cluster. Commander, get to your ship. Link up with the fleet. Yes, sir. You have the Mac gun, Cortana. As soon as they come in range, open up. Yeet them. Gladly. Something's not right. The fleet that destroyed Reach was fifty times this size. <gasps> Sir, additional contacts. Sporting craft and lots of them. Oh shit, Sean Kelly, 50 bucks. Thank you very much, dude. Holy shit, that is a that is an animation and a half. Thank you very much, man. Austin two bucks, what if men could buy a to ride? That would be sick. That would be sick. Right this way. Yeah, thank you so much for the 50 bomb, dude. That's insane. Thank you very much, dude. Got like a fucking Gundam uh, Gundam hippo right there, or Gundam cow. My dude. Thank you very much. I appreciate that massively. Legend. Right. All hands, report to battle station. So, this doesn't seem... I mean, I've played for like literally 10 seconds, so I can't really say much, but it seems fine. I know some people were saying that they were getting quite a lot of stuttering when the like, mission first loaded, but... Mine looks alright. Not stuttering yet. And the stream looks okay as well, I think. Oh, hang on. There we go. As soon as that door opens, let him have it. 
Look at Chad Johnson still in his like military dress. On a fucking MG. Actual Chad of a human being, dude. Oh. This is not a drill. I repeat, this is not a drill. Okay, seems okay so far. Little bit of. Oh my god, the dual wielding! Holy shit, the dual wielding! Bruh. The dual wielding! Hang on. Chat, am I am I going crazy or were they not dual wielding before? They were some of the dual, broken dual wielding elites. And they're dual wielding now. Am I right? Hey, Elijah Long, thanks for 10 bucks, dude. Favorite Halo game is Halo 2. Easily, nothing comes close. Apart from CE. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate it. Uh, two bucks from Steve and Mickey again. Do you think we'll hear more about Lord Hood? We did in a, a short story um, called Rossback's World, I think it was, that came out shortly after Halo 5. Um, as for Infinite, I'd like to think so. I hope so. Um, yeah, thank you for the 10 bucks, uh, Elijah, and the two bucks, Stephen, again. My dude. Okay, I can, yeah. I kind of see what people are on about now. I'm, the gameplay does seem like a little bit stuttery. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Yeah, okay. Okay. I did boot, I did boot up Cairo shortly before... Um, hang on. One sec, guys. Let me just ban somebody for spamming. One second. There we go. Uh, yeah, I did boot up Cairo very briefly before the stream started just to make sure nothing was lagging and it seemed okay. But I didn't get into combat, so... Ooh. Two bucks from Cold East Gaming. Thank you, dude. Favorite game of all time is Halo 2 Anniversary. Yeah, Halo 2 Anniversary is up there for me. I still prefer classic Halo 2, especially in the multiplayer department, but H2A is great as well, especially in campaign. I mean, this campaign is... I need a weapon. <laughs> Are we not bothering? All right. Okay, time to ban somebody else. Good love how god awful YouTube's auto banning is. <laughs> thanks, dude. Thanks for three again, dude. Halo 3 melted face. Oh, he's the best, dude. So majestic. I don't know why, but in this Miranda in H2A in particular, it just looks like her face is melting. I really, I really don't get it. In Halo 3, Lord Hood just looks weird. Like his face textures have not aged particularly well. It's Krona, right? Your currency is Krona, I believe. Or is it Frank? One of the two. Either way, thanks, man. I appreciate it. Not gonna lie, fellas. BXRing with keyboard and mouse feels so nice. I mean, it's not exactly anything new because I have been here on PC before quite a lot, but still. That doesn't change the fact that it feels bloody incredible. Be awesome, so nice as well. Yeah, this stuttering is a little bit annoying. I'm hoping that it's just because I'm streaming. I mean, it shouldn't be, but... Yeah, I prefer Halo 2 over Halo 3 uh, syndrome. Don't get me wrong, I love Halo 3. Um, but Halo 2 story and gameplay is just a lot better in my opinion. I love it. I love it more. Halo 3 is, I mean, this sounds bad saying this and it's not bad at all, but Halo 3 is my least favorite of the original trilogy, but like, I mean, only just behind CE and CE 2 and 3 are all literal masterpieces anyway, so I don't know. Oh. Hey, CE 3, welcome, dude. Nothing much. Playing some glorious H2 on PC. Hope everything is Gucci on your end. Right. At least there's no input lag. Keyboard and mouse feels nice. So far at least. It does feel nice. Aside from the stuttering of course. Hang on, I've got to remember that for some strange reason the Elite in Halo 2 one shot you with melee on normal. Like they, like, like we just witnessed, they, they literally one shot you. So uh, we gotta be careful. 
Yeah, I'm definitely going to do a legendary stream at some point. Just to see if we can even get past Cairo in like four hours. Uh oh. Hey, they're leaving the Athens. <gasps> they're leaving the Athens. Uh, Bordy, yeah, it does, dude. It does. You can still solo fly. It's a lot harder on MCC. Um, I believe it's because of either the resolution or the frame rate. But you can still do it. Hey, Steven, with the five bucks. Thanks, dude. Gather the right here. Oh, my God. Yeah, dude, the boss is going to be back. I'm telling you, the boss will be back. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Star guy with the two bucks. The Mac cannons are beautiful. Absolutely. Amen, dude. They really are beautiful. I agree. Okay, let's wait here because there is a white spec ops elites are going to spawn. There we go. Goodbye. Split neck. You leave Master Guns alone. You bastard. Master Guns, I will take your shotgun and continue your legacy. I will never forget you. Playing on normal, Doctile. Playing on normal for now. Not too easy. Not too difficult. Oh. No turret for you today, son. Junior, thank you for the five bucks, dude. So when do I participate in the Midget Resurrection? <laughs> the ongoing rebellion. Uh, in about 500 years time. 530 years time, maybe. Around that around that time. You may want to start allying with some... Uh, some little grunts around that time. Dude, these bots of are, are spammers are so goddamn annoying. Holy shit. Oh shit, kid in the blue hat. Thank you for the 20 bucks, dude. Hidden Xperia team respawn general kid of the best Halo channels on YouTube. Shares the Halo to on PC after all these years. Thank you very much, man. I agree. Team respawn are great. General kid is going general heed slash kid. I never know what to call him. Heed or kid. One of the two. Either way, they're both great. Team Respawn do some damn good uh, Halo War stuff, and General Heed is like the glitching guy, so. Very iconic. Do I think Halo 3 has a good storyline? I do. I love Halo 3's story to death, I just prefer Halo 2 and Halo CE. Don't worry, man, we're on it. Oh, I forgot Miranda was even there. Hang on, let's break the time on and kill her. Right, come in, Miranda. This is for your own good. This is so you don't say to war in Halo 3. I'm sorry, Miranda, but you said to war in Halo 3, and it just it just wasn't acceptable. Oh my god, I can't what the fuck? <laughs> I've never seen that before. <laughs> Bruh. Okay. That's enough punishment for saying to war. The Halo season challenges. Uh, I don't know. They're the challenges they added recently. Or like with this update. So I looked in the menu earlier and I couldn't find them anywhere. This, uh, this, this like entire section... And the music they use it in particular, for some reason, always makes me, like, kind of space out. Which I guess is the intention, maybe, because we're in space. Haha, <laughs> but, like, something about the music is, like, so chill. Just, like, calm. Sir, borders have comforting. The fire control center. They have a bomb. They got a bomb. Can you it? Yes, but I'll need the chief's help to make contact with the detonator. Chief, get to the bomb. Double time. Cortana, prioritize targets and fire at will. Lovely BR ammo. Yeah, I mean, I love Halo 2 Anniversary's soundtrack. I still massively prefer Halo C, uh, Halo 2's, like Marty's work. But Halo 2 Anniversary is great as well. I'm going loud. One thing I'm not particularly keen on is how they made the classic soundtrack quieter. Um, in Anniversary, so like when you switch back, the soundtrack's quieter and it, it's not really mixed very well. I mean, I imagine it wasn't done, on, like, intentionally, but still, it's kind of annoying. Because I want to hear Marty's stuff. That sticks one. Oh! We're pixels away from sticking that poor little grin. Another stutter. Yikers! 
the Iker school. He's the Scarab school, not right now. That's, uh, that's a bit cheating. Down we go. I agree, uh, Rafika. I agree, my dude. Wholeheartedly. Halo 2 is just... Are any of the audio issues fixed yet? Dude, these fucking spammers. Holy shit. You gotta love uh, YouTube's god-awful auto-spam detection feature. Uh, spam. That just, like, doesn't work. <laughs> Hey, first stream. Welcome, dude. Oh, did I meet you? Good to meet you, man. Yeah, our post is great. Kind of sucks that it wasn't on this year, but <laughs> in hindsight, <laughs> it's a good job they cancelled it because they would have had to cancel it anyway because of... Or good job they didn't do it this year because they would have had to cancel it anyway because of uh, the old virus. Admiral, do what you can against the second. Everyone, form up. Follow my lead. Oh, shit. Hello. This section is so cool. Actually fighting on a Mac cannon as it's firing is sick. The first carrier it's kind of an underrated moment, Earth. honestly. You hope they show something in Reach Airborne. I mean, you never know. I mean, Shadows of Reach is a thing, so... You never know. Oh, look at that. My torso. Voice might be a little bit loud. Uh, okay, I'll move the mic a little bit further away. Maybe that'll fix it. Unfortunately, this poor elite still lost his uh, jewel wielding needlers. Poor guy. Oh wait, hang on. Oh no, I got excited for a second then, thinking that he had, he had dual plasma rifles. Look how they massacred my boy! Look how they massacred my boy! I'm sorry, elite major. He wouldn't have dual wielded the needlers and doesn't anymore. Halo 2 with, with ray tracing would be very nice. You'd love to see it. The carrier shield is down. I'm in position and ready for immediate assault. Negative, Commander. Not against a ship that size. Not on your own. Sir, permission to leave the station. <gasps> Iconic moment purpose, incoming! To give the Covenant back their bomb. Permission granted. Uh, Sea Witch, this is not legendary, dude. This is, this is normal. Orange Soda King, is that the glitch where you can play as like any NPC? And no, I haven't done yet, but I want to try it. Thank you for the five bucks, dude. And also, thank you for the five bucks, Kid in the Blue Hat again. Fighting in Matt Cannon's firing Halo 4. Technically, yeah, you do. On the on the Mammoth and also, whoa, the Hyperion missiles on the on the Dawn. I need a weapon. And also on the on the Mammoth, but yeah, technically you do. Thank you for the five bucks, guys. I appreciate it. Yeah, that glitch is really cool, though. Just one question. What if you miss? I won't. Look at that for timing. Look at that for timing. Do you have a Twitch? I do indeed. Just twitch.tv slash Nexperia. I stream over there um, a few times a week. Go and follow it. <laughs> this cutscene as well looks so fucking good in Anniversary. Seeing that frigate just get torn apart. Or how uh, that's a halcyon actually, isn't it? Not a frigate. I mean it looks sick in both, but holy shit. That is like that is like the most cinematic looking thing. Oh, the long sword. I just nut every time I see a longsword. It is it is unquestionably the best Halo vehicle. Nothing comes close to the longsword. Not the broadsword, not the mongoose, not the warthog, the ghost, the wraith, the scorpion, the wasp, the hornet. Nada. I 
I need a weapon. Junior Theo, thank you for the five bucks, dude. I can't wait for the Skyrim mission. The side of it will be orga orgasmic. It will be indeed. He flew pretty good. Thanks for the five bucks, dude. I appreciate it. Ooh, the order is a bit choppy there. Oh, it's peaking too much. The wasp, yeah, the wasp. That thing in Halo 5. That was like... Oh, challenge complete. So challenges are in this game then. Okay. Yeah, the wasp was that vehicle they added in Halo 5. Um, like the one the one seat. It was basically like... It was like a one-seater UNSC VTOL. Like, it was alright, but it was just another one-seater air vehicle. Bring back the Falcon. Bring back the Falcon. I would love to see that Keto. Oh, okay. Are we, uh... Are we stuck loading? There we go. The message just repeats. Regret. 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 Catch it. Any idea what it means? Dear humanity, we regret being alien bastards. We regret coming to Earth. And we most definitely regret the core just blew up our raggedy ass fleet. Hoorah. Regret is a name, Sergeant. The name of one of the Covenant's religious leaders, a prophet. He's on that carrier and he's calling for help. No! Really not a fan of the H2A Warthog. I'm gonna be honest, fellas. We're going in. Get tactical, Marines! Going oh. in. Secure the profit of regret. This is the only place on earth the covenant decided to land. That profit is going Oh, I'm to getting the sniper, don't you worry, Mix Nation. This, I am getting that sniper. Johnson's not having that for a second. Whoa. Whoa. Ooh. God, this guy looks so good in this game. Yeah, uh, the Warthog in this is just a Halo 4 Warthog, and I really, really don't like the Halo 4 Warthog. <laughs> so, uh... This remaster is almost perfect. At least the campaign. The multiplayer... h multiplayer is god-awful, but... The campaign is almost perfect. Close, but no cigar. Well, close, but three quarters of a cigar. Ooh, this is a bit choppy. Oh, does it actually activate blind? No, it doesn't. Okay. I thought it did for a second. Oh, this is bloody choppy. This is. No. Hey, thanks for again, dude. One thing in infinite. Scarable longsword. Oh, don't do that to me. I'm going to say, as much as I absolutely fucking adore the longsword, I'm going to say Scarab because just like the, the encounters that you get with it are just unparalleled. And if it is the Banishing Infinite, then I can't pass up an opportunity to get the Banished Scarab in a game. That thing, we need to fight that thing in an FPS game. That would be an absolute dream. I need a Come here, son. Oh, okay, no. Marines have already got it. Yeah, thanks for the two though, dude. I appreciate it. I love the longsword so much though. Easily the best the best vehicle in Halo. And actually, technically, uh Actually the Scarab isn't a vehicle, actually. It's a it's like an infantry unit. Actually. <laughs> for being <laughs> you know what I mean. Come here. I don't know how viable this would ever be, but one thing I'd love to see get modded into like Halo 2 and Halo 3 is assassinations. I mean, it's basically, I, I assume, like basically impossible, but <laughs> I'd love to see it happen. We got jackals in the courtyard. I swear to God, I must have played this campaign now well over a hundred times. Like not even close. It's well, well over a hundred times. Yeah, that Halo 2 possession glitch is really cool. Okay, now we got buggers. Bugger, 
Yeah, this is a little bit stuttery. This is a bit worse than Cairo, not gonna lie. But it's not, it's not awful. I mean, it's not great, but it's not awful. It could definitely be worse. It could definitely be worse. That's for sure. Right, chat. Let's take out some hunters. Oh, they're not spawning it, are they? I want to try and take out a hunter with a skull. It's going to end... That is going to end terribly. Ooh. Snappy. <laughs> Cop in damn steam, please. <laughs> Pretty much. You may as well stop playing that as soon as the hunters blast through the door. You may as well, dude. Oh. Oh, that was bad. Fuck me. Look at this chad down here. My god. Uh, it's just the overall design, Gab. Um, it's, it, the, the role, it's just, I don't know. They, they mess with the silhouette too much. I really hate the turret shield. Um, the hydrogen canisters on the back, I just think it look a bit silly. I, the roll cage, like, makes sense, but I don't like it. I just, I just don't like it. I just, like, Bungie had a very consistent Warthog design from, like, CE through Reach. And it, it, it like many things, it didn't need changing, but it was changed for no reason. <laughs> oh, hello. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> I'm going to shelter here with you. Mr. Marine, whose face doesn't have any lighting on it. <laughs> oh. See, I was going to go for a bounce there, and the game stuttered. You hate to see it. Oh, nope. Whoops. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, it's Jonathan. It's all right. God, H2A Chief looks so nice, dude. I love the in-game model so much. It is literally Halo 2's, but better. Like, it's one of the few things I'll say about... Oh, you'll, hear, you'll hear me to say that about. It's so good. Look at that. Right then, where's my skull? Look <laughs> at these Marines hunking down. Here we go. Oh shit. I mean, you basically can't melee them in this game, so this is a fool's errand, as is. Oh shit, okay. Yeah, you basically can't, you can't melee them to death in this game anyway, but... An attempt will be made. The Marines can deal with that one. Now this is why you fund a billion dollar, possibly even trillion dollar super soldier program. Look at this. This is just high IQ Spartan game. Oh, we hit, we hit flash. Uh oh, <laughs> just infinitely stagger him. I didn't realize he could do that. Let's try and get him. His Bond brother just sat there, just looking at him. Takadina, thanks for the five bucks, dude. It was a six year time jump from Halo 3 to Halo 4. So changes. Uh, I mean, yeah, but I still don't like it though. I mean, say, that, say the same about Chief's armor. I still don't like it. All the weapon designs, all the covenant designs. I, I don't like any of it. And there was, I, I don't think there was any, well, I don't personally believe there was any reason for any of it to change. Uh, and thankfully, 343 seemed to finally agree with Halo Infinite. But yeah, thanks for the five bucks, dude. I appreciate it. Right, so. Hunters. Stand back, Marine. Let the chief show you how it's done. Bit late, Jonathan, but you know. Alex Massimiani, thank you for the 20 bucks, dude. Thank you very much. No message, but a massive 20 bomb, which is insane. Thank you very much, man. Legend. Right, you are not getting me. There we go. Jackals with sniper rifles. Oh shit. Sergeant, I need you on that bird. 
My pelicans are gonna start airlifting armor and reinforcements in this city. They'll need an escort that isn't afraid of a little hostile ground fire. People might have messed up the input output for the damage. Legendary difficulties. Uh, maybe. I honestly, I don't want to judge that too much because I can't remember if that happens in classic Halo 2 as well. Like back in the day. I've got a feeling that it doesn't. But I'm not, I'm not entirely sure. What if you miss? Oh, that took my surprise then. For some reason, they're really delayed. I'm not sure why. Uh, there we go. Oh, now this is a soundtrack. You probably noticed that I use this, uh, I use this bit of Halo 2 soundtrack in literally every video because it's like the best. <laughs> so good. I'm going to try and arm every single one of these marines with a beam rifle. Where are you, son? Take that. And then... There's one more marine somewhere. Where are you, son? There you are. You all right, amigo? Hell yeah, amigo. Look at that for a death squad. Noble team who? Noble team who? And <laughs> yet they're still missing all the shots. You gotta love it. Hello. Hello. There's so many little areas back here that you never really see. Like this. Why is that truck there? What is its purpose? What's the law behind this truck? Surprise, motherfucker! Dude, they've all got beam rifles and they can't kill a single grunt. Poor show. Right, we're going to kill these guys and then we're going to get the wreck sword. No. There we go. Right, let's get the sword. I'm not going to need the sniper. Because I'm going to get the sword, which I believe is up there, right? Yeah, it is. This area around here is actually quite open world. You don't realize that until you actually properly explore it. Optimus Prime in disguise. <laughs> Imagine, dude. Hang on. Oh, it's in there, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There it is. The Rex Sword. Never seen most of this stuff. Yeah, dude. It's, I remember exploring this a lot when I was a kid. Um, but I'm not surprised some people haven't because a lot of it is very hidden. Like what, like the sword there. You never think to go into like that that room up there. But it's so cool that you can. That's why it, like Halo 2's level design gets quite a lot of flack. And I understand some of it, but... There's a reason it's my favorite, and that that is the reason. That is the reason. Like it's so open, you can go wherever you want. There's so much shit to explore. Like even if it wasn't intentionally put there, so cool. Hey Alex, you have the ten bucks, dude. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate it. Have you completed all the cross games on MCC? Not the playlist, no. Um, I mean, I'll, I've done the campaigns and all that, but uh, not the not the playlist. Uh, I haven't done that. I've done some of them, not all of them though. Thank you for the ten bucks, there, dude. I appreciate it. Very generous, my dude. Very, yes, very generous. Lighting in this room is kind of fu- Oh, okay. A bit of texture popping. What's the law on this corpse? <laughs> I need a weapon. Oh, another bit of stuttering. Just chilling. I'm pretty sure. Is that meant to be Marcus Leo? On the other side of this hotel, Chief. Covenant are crawling all over it. Follow Looks a me. bit like Marcus Leo. Right, let's try uh I'll try sword flying actually. The truck is the key to Halo in for that. <laughs> Jay Bora, thanks a lot, dude. I appreciate it. Oh sh I'm running. I need a weapon. Oh. 
away with you. Ah, I love it when accounts can just get in and spam in chats. Nice job, YouTube. Amazing job. You love to see it. I'm not using the Scarab Beam Skull because it's, it's they will just ruin a playthrough. It's no point. Dude, what the fuck? I need to get some mods in here so we can just ban these spammers like immediately. <laughs> I'm terribly sorry, Grunts. My boy came out of nowhere. <laughs> right, you know what? I'm going to try and do a sword fly over these guys. See if I can do it. Oh my god, that didn't knock it off. Nah, that was a an awful attempt at a sword play. <laughs> Why is New Mombasa different between Halo 2 and Halo 3 ODST? Uh, I mean, you're in different sections of New Mombasa. Um, ODST, like, over there. In New Mombasa as opposed to Old Mombasa, but still, it's like, it's more, more of like an artistic change, kind of, for New Mombasa. See... To me, then the H2A the ghost doesn't sound great. Halo 2, on the other hand. Butter. Absolute butter. Winterfall is dead. Thank you for the 10 bucks, dude. Would you rather try to domesticate a raccoon or an emu? Um, I don't know. I'm, I'm going to say emu because I'm, I'm pretty sure... I mean, the Australians did lose a, a great war against them. But uh, I feel like it would be easier to, to do it. Seems they're more, they're more like birds and a lot, a lot less wild. That's an interesting question though. Thank you very much for the 10 bucks, Steve. I appreciate it. Team Mel with the 10 bucks as well. Thank you very much. Halo game idea. The fall of high charity from the perspective of an elite stationed during the events of, and leading up to I need a, weapon. a flood infestation. Absolutely, dude. Absolutely. I'm pretty sure a few years ago I made either a video partly dedicated to that or a video dedicated to that, that idea like in its entirety. And I love the idea. Either that or a game where like you play as one of the marines in one of the holding cells as the flood outbreak begins and you have to like escape high charity and navigate like through the lower districts and stuff while the flood are invading and while the infection is spreading. I feel like that could be kind of sick. I'd love to see that. Honestly, I really hope that a horror game is the first direction that people 3 go with the spin-offs uh, after Infinite. So I mean, the the massive resurgence in, in horror games recently, thanks to like Outlast, um, you got stuff like Amnesia as well that kicked it off in like 2012. And then like also the, the massive resurgence in games like Resident Evil as well has proven that horror games are like back, like fully back. <laughs> Thank you for getting me up the ladder. <laughs> but yeah, I feel like a horror game for Halo is just, it's just, it's just waiting to happen. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate it. Thank you for the two ten bucks. Text over the five as well, my dude. Thank you very much. As soon as exams are over, gonna need some help for MCC old Halo 3 Vidmas achievements. Oh yeah, dude. When it comes to PC, we should do that. That'd be a good, that'd actually be a really good game night. Oh, I was gonna try and snipe the power core on the side, but oh well. Absolutely though. I need a weapon. We should do that. Oh. The carrier just launched a wave of pods. They're inbound on your position. Yeah, it doesn't sound quite as iconic as this. Hello. I'm pretty sure there's a terminal in here, isn't there? Yeah, there we go. Not that I'm going to activate it, because, I mean, I've seen the terminals about three billion times now. The ins I said this last time when I was playing Halo 2, I'm going to say it again. The inside of those uh, elite drop pods looks like the inside of a conquer to me. Like, it's so silky and smooth. Stanley S, thanks for the five bucks, dude. Just really hit it on Legendary and don't think I can ever play the game again. That's a reasonable reaction. Thank you very much for the five bucks, dude. Halo of all, thank you for the Australian five. Thank you very much. Do you want to go back to Human Covenant War for future games? I've always been more interested in that. Absolutely, dude. I, I agree wholeheartedly. Um, I honestly find most post-war stuff really boring. Uh, like, I, I don't know. I just, I don't think it's anywhere near as interesting as, as like, Human Covenant War stuff or, like, Foreign of Flood War stuff. I, I think post-war is really boring. 
At least right now, um, I think it's kind of boring. So I, I do hope in the future we get more games set during the Human Covenant Wars. I mean, the end, almost the entirety of the 2530s and a lot of the 2540s in the timeline are just completely empty. Like, there's just nothing that happens in them that we know of. I mean, there is obviously stuff that happens, but nothing documented. Um, so there's so much room there for potential. No! Oh, God damn it. There's so much room. I agree, Lightskins. I agree, dude. I hope Infinite is uh, like a higher rating as well. I really do. This tunnel links up to the bridge. It's full of rats, if you know what I mean. But it beats swimming. <laughs> but it beats swimming. I never knew what she meant when I was a kid. I always, I always thought she said race, but pronounced it rats. I've been analyzing the Covenant tactics. But she didn't. Chatter. Rats. They're surprised. Confused. I don't think they expected us to be here. Very, very yeah. excited this world, Jacob. Very excited, my dude. I cannot wait. On Earth. Odd, I know, but it does help explain why they came here with such a small fleet. Very excited. Those designs to me are Halo. Like, that's just Halo to me. And seeing it all come back is so nice. I really hope they go, like, really hard into it, though, and don't, don't just, like, bait us with, like, classic assets for trainers and stuff. <laughs> nice try, nerd. Oh, okay. Yep, no, that is actually quite a nice try. No one can stop me. Is that ghost stuck? No, it's not. We're good. We're good. Your water alarm just went off. What is a water alarm? It is, now, is it maybe an alarm for water? Oh god, I forgot drones could... I forgot drones could hijack you in this. This is normal. Playing on normal today. Not legendary. <laughs> not yet, at least. I do want to do a legendary stream. Just see how far I can get before I want to top myself. But for now, this is, uh, this is very much not legendary. This is normal. Oh, shit. Gen 2 fish. Are we that close? I didn't notice. Nice. Uh, where did I get my mic? From an audio store. Um, you can get this mic from, like, pretty much anywhere that sells mics, though. It's, it's a really popular one. Um, it's called the Shaw SM7B. Oh. What was this guy doing? Backing up, ready to go, go for, like, a big jump or something. I don't know. It's a very good microphone. I uh, I do recommend it. Oh. <laughs> Imagine being an elite warrior training for years to honor your family and, and fulfill the great journey. And you get taken out by, by the seat of a ghost. Your life ends by being hit by the seat of a ghost. Poor guy. I'm using uh, Astro A50s. My head's up. <gasps> what is that? That's such a cool reveal for the Scarab. Like, in-game. Very cool. Big fan. Oh, almost flipped me. Didn't quite manage it. What's my favorite brute design? Um, Halo 2... Then Halo Wars 2, then Halo 3, then Halo Reach. I love Halo 2s. And I like that for Halo Wars 2, they went out of their way where they could at least to mimic Halo 2's design. Um, it's, it's definitely the best in my opinion. I, I love Halo 2's brute design. Hey, Ross, won't be a stream without you, my dude. Welcome. Thank you for the five quid. I hope Infinite will be the last game set during the post-war era. I'd love to see games expand uh, Lord Noble team. Yeah, same, Ross. I agree. Thanks for the five quid. Hey, holy shit. Initialization zero, zero. 50 quid, my dude. Thank you very much, you absolute iconic man. Thank you very much, dude. Legend. Everyone needs to go and sub to Initialization zero, zero right now. Oh, I know what the ladies like. Right now. Absolutely, most iconic lore content out there, I and I, I said that. Good to see you've heard a little gift from me to you. Keep being iconic, zero zero out. Fucking legend. Thank you very much, man. Thank you very much. We've got a collab again soon, actually. Let's uh, let's let's start working on something soon. 
Let's start working on the collab soon. I'm not sure what. I'm not sure when, but soon. And on something. Let's, let's do something again. That only video was fun. And I feel like it'd be rude to just... To just, to just do one collab, you know? Let's do something else. Oh, God. I really wish the shadows were in this game more. It's kind of cool. Big Covenant Transport Vehicle is the shadow. It is the shadow. Um, they are literally just like Covenant buses, essentially. <laughs> kind of, at least. Not literally, but like kind of. Kind of. Zoom. Look how small the wings are on this. I'm basically not even there. I'm basically driving a Covenant motorbike right now. Or like a Covenant Tron bike. Yeah, it would have been cool to see the shadows on Metropolis, I agree. Or just like somewhere else. They're a really cool design. They're in Halo Oblivion though, thankfully. So they're actually, they're, they're still like being fleshed out a little bit in the canon at least. Okay, only a little bit. We're going to skip these guys because they're going to like insta me. Oh, shit. I don't think we could possibly lose any more of this ghost if we tried. Maybe Soda King. So I know that, um, like, is there, there's only a, there's a flag or something that's enabled that only lets elites drive them, so maybe. I, I agree, Caleb. 100%. That would be fucking sick if they got Steve Vai back. Just get some water, lads. Right 50 cal. Rockets into a thing. Best Scorpion design. Halo Reaches and Halo 4s for me, I think. And also Halo 2 Anniversaries. I love this design so much. Where's the rest of your platoon? Wait, oh, he's did a Sarge. And we will be too, sir, if we don't get the hell out of here. You hit Marine. <laughs> no, 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 sir. Then listen up. The chief is going to jump in this tank, roll across the bridge, and blow up any inhuman son of a bitch dumb enough to get between him and the prophet of regret. Pull yourself together, because you're going Is that to David Cross? We've all run the simulations. They're tough, but they ain't invincible. Hang on, David, that is David Tobias Funke, right? Know what to do. Yes, sir, Sergeant. I'm... Thanks for the tank. He never gets me anything. Oh my god, that's David Cross. Know what the ladies like. No. Holy shit, Tobias Funke is in Halo 2. What? I had no idea about that. What? <laughs> Bruh. The more you know, holy shit. Favorite elite from Reach, either the Field Marshal or Spec Ops. Yeah, this, this is honestly my favorite Scorpion design. Reach, Foreign in H2A. That's one of the few designs that um, 343 sort of modified a little bit in Halo 4 that I really do like. I think the Scorpion looks fantastic. Like, this is pinnacle Scorpion to me. Captain Condescending, thank you for the new membership, dude. And Alex again with the 10 bucks. My dude, thank you very much. Ancient Humanity in Halo Infinite. And I'm talk not talking about, <laughs> about cave paintings. That would be sick if, like, there was a, what are they called? Like a Florian or something. Not really Ancient Humanity, but like a, like a subspecies. Like a Florian or something still alive. Rises great, 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 like a billion times recurring Granison. <laughs> that would be kind of joke. I really hope we see more of those cave paintings though, because they were that that in the first trailer might still be the coolest thing that we've seen from Infinite. Honestly for me. That that cave painting was so cool. Or the markings, I guess. But yeah, thanks for the 10 bucks, dude. I appreciate it. You never know. Ryzen might be a thing. Do I still play Reach? Uh, no. <laughs> I don't. I'm, I'm really, really, really not a fan of Halo Reach. Um, I, I, I was ready to give it another shot when it came back on PC, but I just... I really don't like the gameplay. I hate Reach's gameplay so much. It, it's just not... I can't, I can't enjoy it. I can't enjoy it personally. It's not for me. I love the story, um, and that's about the only thing, but the gameplay, I just can't stand it. Like, if I ever play Reach's campaign, I always do it with Ventral Vidam's 
Reach Evolve mod, because that to me just makes the um, thingy, the uh, weapon sandbox, so much more interesting. Yeah, I love Reach's, I love Reach's story, but not the not the campaign, or not the actual campaign itself or the gameplay. I just, I really am not a fan. <laughs> I'm seeing a lot of very, very different polarizing replies in the chat. Hey, three from Tagster again, dude. Thank you very much. Keep my spot for the Vidmaster. See you around, man. Absolutely, dude. I will do. I will do. Thanks for the for the donuts, dude. Thank you for stopping by. I appreciate it. Yeah, absolutely. We'll get them. We'll get them done. Okay, I need a weapon. Goodbye, Wraith. Oh, the elite campaign mode. The um. The one that made by Cable Instinct. Yeah, that was cool. That was cool. <laughs> yeah, Team Hardcore, like, zero, zero Sprint, no Bloom is the only version of Reach that I can play and partially enjoy. I just, I hate Standard Reach so much. I hate Bloom, I hate Spartan or oh, Arm Abilities. The maps aren't great outside of, like, Countdown and... Um, Countdown, Zealot, what else? Invasion maps as well. Invasion is fucking fantastic. That's that is another thing that I love from Reach. I love Invasion. Invasion is something that absolutely needs to come back, but more fleshed out because six v six is like way too small. Invasion is fucking great. Flawless Cowboy. That is an iconic name. Twenty bucks. Thank you, dude. I appreciate it. We're getting more classic art, but we need original gameplay back. I agree. Do you plan on making a video on that and how Sprint hurts Halo and break down the gameplay slash design reach start of this? Yeah, um, I mean, I've done it before. And honestly, like, the comment section has been rough. And it's put me off making more videos like it. I know I shouldn't let that happen. I know that's kind of stupid. But, like, the comment section on these videos is always really rough. Um, it's just people arguing constantly. Um... When it, let's see how, what, what Infinite's gameplay is like. Because if it's just Halo 5 all over again, then I absolutely will do. Because, um, like, when it comes to Infinite, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to be honeymoon phase this time. I'm going to be as realistic as it comes with giving feedback. Like, if the game is great, I'm going to praise it to the high heavens. If I think it's shit, then I'm going to, I'm going to, like, criticize the shit out of it. I mean, uh, and if, if the gameplay is fully enhanced, then I'm going to, I'm going to be going, like, hard into that. We'll see. We'll have to see how the gameplay is. I'm praying for classic, but I'm not holding my breath. Uh, but yeah, thank you for the 20 bucks, dude. I appreciate it. Thank you for stopping by. Vash Uchiha. Uch Uchiha. 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 One of the two. Thank you for the new membership, dude. I appreciate it. Welcome. Oh, God. That's going to kill me, I think. Ooh. Okay. Okay. And before anybody asks, no, we're not getting a Banshee and doing the Scarab, the, the Scarab gun. We'll be here for bloody days. Would you be okay if Halo Infinite had a classic gameplay mode and an enhanced mode? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, if they want to go ahead and create two entirely separate instances of the game with different weapon sandboxes, different maps, different, like, like altered maps and campaign missions, by all means, do it. I, I would be perfectly down for that. But realistically, that like the amount of resources that I take is just astronomical and... I don't expect them to do that, and I don't think anybody should expect them to do that because no matter your views on like enhanced versus classic gameplay, that is just far, far too great of an ask for for any dev studio. Like that, that would be essentially like creating two separate games, which is a lot. Um, but I just, I just hope it's classic. Jay Burrow, what's your opinion on Halo 4 Covenant vehicle design? Um, firstly, thank you for the five bucks, dude. Uh. Visually, I love the ghost. The ghost looks great. Um, the wraith looks pretty good. Uh, what else is there? I don't like the banshee at all because it's the reach banshee and I hate the reach banshee. Um, I like the ghost. Uh, the, lich, the lich is cool as well. I like the lich. Um, what else? What is that? The banshee lich. The cruisers look really sick because they just look like classic cruisers but with like different colors with green instead of blue. Um, Is it yeah, the the Banshee's the only one that I don't like because it's the Reach like one, so. and I hate the Reach Banshee, so. <laughs> yeah, but everything else looks sick. It's Halo 5 where they started changing the Covenant and stuff, even though technically it was all meant to be Elite, but I, that's just an excuse. I don't like any of Halo 5's 
Covenant and stuff, honestly. Um, fours were so much better. Yeah, fours. I'm not keen on the the vehicle sounds in four at all, but the design is already sick. Fours ghost in particular looks really nice. Good performance so far. Um, kind of Cameron, a little bit. Oh, I just got blamed by a jackal sniper. Kind of. It's not been great, but it's not been like terrible by any means. It's it's playable. Um, to be fair. So far on Metropolis, we've had no stuttering, apart from like right at the start where it froze for like a second. But other than that, it's been fine. Five pounds from Mr. Sam Ford. Thank you, dude. What would you think of a Halo spin-off game in the style of the old Pandemic Battlefront games? That would be sick. That would be sick. I'd love that. That'd be dope. I would uh, I would support the fuck out of that. With like loads of different factions, like like UNSC, Souls of St. Helios, Insurrectionist, Blood, Covenant, uh, Prometheans. That'd be sick. Kota 1, thank you for the two bucks, dude. Would you like to see original Iconic Scarab Gun? Uh, yes, I would. I absolutely would do. Bring her back in Infinite, 343. Bring it back. Thank you for the for the donuts, fellas. I appreciate it. I always forget how, like, deceptively difficult Halo 2 can be on normal. Like, even though it's normal, it's quite easy to get peeled. Come on, Jackal Sniper. I know you're on this. There you are. Nah. Halo Reach versus Fall of Reach. Uh, I'm. See, I, I honestly like them both. They tell very different stories. The way they tell the story is very different. Obviously, they don't quite line up. Um, but I don't know. I like them both as their own things. I'm not one of these people that like viciously hates one over the other. I like them both. Uh, I think they're both good tellings of Reach's downfall. Um, I do prefer in the fall of Reach how Reach fell in literally a day. It makes it seem a lot more drastic and a lot more of a crushing defeat to the UNSC than uh, in Reach the game. But overall, I still love them both. I think they're both great. Use you on the gun, Chief. Use you on the gun, Chief. How do you give a donation? Um, there's a little dollar sign below the chat, I think, that you should just be able to hit. Oh, dude. The gorse, the gorse turret sounds sick, don't get me wrong, in H2A, but that sound, to me, is like absolute chef's kiss. What do you think of a 12v12 invasion? I'd ideally like it to be bigger than 12v12. I'm talking like, like Battlefield 64, 64 size servers. That would be perfect. Oh my god, what happened there? Crikey me. Stacker, your driving is crazy, Sim. Oh my Stacker, what are you doing? Is that, oh, okay, I've just put him down. Sorry, Stacker, but... You know, you drive like a maniac. It's gonna happen, son. Where did that goose go? Hang on, there, there it is. There it is. How long would it take to get your level of lore knowledge? Um, I mean, I've been reading Halo books since, I want to say, like, 2004, probably? Oh, that audio mixing was a bit rough. Jesus Christ, that just kind of I need a weapon. came in. Kota1, thank you for the five bucks, dude. When you play HG Legendary, you learn every Jackal Sniper spawn. I still remember, even though I last played in 2016. Yeah, you kind of have to, don't you? I mean, um, especially on Outskirts and Regret, those two missions in particular, and also Gravemind, you basically have to learn them. Like, if you don't know them at the back of your hand, you're not getting past those missions. It's as simple as that. Thank you for the five bucks, dude. I appreciate it. That is true, Cryo. That is true. There's one person that you definitely can't trust, and she's she's it. Concentrate on the wraiths. They're the biggest threat. Hang on. Oh, 18 Hong Kong dollars, I believe that is. Thank you very much. Uh, a name that I can't pronounce, but thank you very much, dude. I appreciate it. That's sick. Thanks, man. Oh. I love doing that with lock-on weapons in uh, in Halo's engine. 
Like, e you can even do it in Halo 5 with the Hydra. Turn it into, like, a mini artillery. You just launch it up. Even though sometimes it does miss. Fly away, son. Fly. Be free. Are they really going to drop that? <laughs> nice try. Would I like hitting Noble 6 and Halo Infinite? Um, no. I mean, if we're on reaching Infinite, then, like, I, I do feel like a Noble 6 helmet Easter egg would be sick. Don't get me wrong. I'd love to see that. But it's a Jackal Sniper alive. Dude. 30 Swedish Kroner from Arvid Halden. Thank you very much, man. Thank you, dude. I appreciate that. It always makes me feel kind of happy when we get, uh, like, people from all different corners of the of the world Sir, watching us. Hey, I don't know. It's really cool. We're reaching whole different audiences, which is, which is sick. Halo fans right, across the globe. Uh, Sergeant Banks, ma'am. He's up top. Thank you very much, Arvid. Thanks for your support on Hong Kong. Oh, uh, <laughs> no problem, dude. I need a weapon. No problem. What's happening over there is not is not nice at all. It's uh, it's not not good. Not good. Almost 400k subs. I know, right, Ghost Hunter? It's, dude, Ghost, it's insane, man. Like, it's, that number is astronomical. Like, not to, like, blow my own horn or anything, but the fact that we've managed to hit that during the worst dry period in Halo's history is... Like, I'm, I'm very, very proud of that, to be honest with you. I'm proud of all of us for getting there. Um... Yeah, it's great though. Artichoke, thanks for the five bucks, dude. So nice to see the most iconic Halo on PC for the first time ever, with definitely no failures on broken OSs in the past. Yeah, exactly. My man gets it. Thank you very much, Artichoke. <laughs> yeah, Vista was not particularly great. Thanks, game for Windows Live. Thanks for the five bucks, dude. And Kurt one with the two bucks again. Which ghost is better, CE2 or 3? Um, I don't know, actually. I think I probably prefer Halo 3s. And then twos and then sees. This bit's so cool. I wish there were more marines here though. Like a full on mounted defense would be sick. Should we jump? Yeah, we're jumping. Oh shit. By the rings, this is too much. Well, at least a pussy, dude. Oh my god, how many? Jesus, how many mages are in there? Is this like the official elite major scarab or something? My goodness. Nice try. Come on, drop the sword. Drop the sword. Drop the sword. Careful, there we go. That elite was an ultra, and those pilots are gonna push over either. The interior of the scarab is so nice. Yikes, I forgot about that. <laughs> I would pick C for the physics. That's true. The physics are uh, quite something. <laughs> Thanks for the two books again, Kruta. I appreciate it, dude. Kruta, not Kruta. Yeah, C's vehicle physics were quite something. It's quite a joke that uh Modern Warfare 2019 Warzone has like literally the same physics. It's a, uh, it's quite something in that game as well. Sorry, Miner. Oh, just over his head. Oh my God, that nade just. Launch that rocket. Oh my, dude, how many majors? So many majors. Uh, grenade launcher, definitely. Definitely. Um, I was never... I'm not the only person on planet Earth who isn't a fan of the sticky detonator. I thought it was kind of boring. I think the grenade launcher was a much better weapon. How's the porting till now? Uh, it's okay orbit. Um, I've not encountered any of the really bad bugs that people have seen so far. Um, oh, Minky. Min Mickey. Mickey, not Minky. Mickey. Thanks for the, for the two bugs, dude. Uh, yeah, I'll answer the question as well. Yes, yeah, so the porting so far 
I've not encountered any like horrendous bugs that people have been um, been reporting. That said, I'm only on like the fourth mission, fifth mission, so we've got quite a long way to go yet. So you never know, but uh, it doesn't seem terrible yet. I've had a few stutters. And the audio is kind of fucked in places, but it's not, like, game-breaking. Oh, shit. No, don't chase me. Please don't. Can I, Odra, again, thanks for the 100, dude. I hope Infinite at least has a more coherent and focused story than Halo 5. And popular opinion, but I think Halo 4 story. Oh, that's not unpopular by any means, dude. I mean, I don't like Halo 4 as a game overall, but the story is fantastic. Like, that's undeniable. Um, I agree, though, dude. I agree. Alex, thank you for the, for the 10 bucks again, dude. Tartarus versus, Ar versus Atriox, who would, who would win in a fight? I, I would be inclined to say Atriox, but that's a video that I need to do. I need to do that really badly. That's that's probably the next versus video that I'll make, actually. Um, I feel like that would be a cool comparison. Is that Jackal T-posing? I'm almost certain that Jackal was T-posing. But yeah, thanks for 10 bucks, dude. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Yeah, I do understand why some people don't like Halo 4 story. It's it's very much... Oh my god. It's very much like a, a polarizing story because it was, it was different. It wasn't Halo's typical story. I enjoyed it personally, like, mainly because I love the Didact and seeing him in a game was great. Um, but I do understand why some people didn't like it. That's, that's reasonable. I don't agree with the complaint that it was a, a love story because it really wasn't. I, I don't agree with that at all. Um, but I do I do understand why some people don't like it. Totally. Man, Rough Planet, that is a dream. That is an absolute dream right there. Sneak that melee in. Nice, nice. Why is there a Jackal Sniper on here still? Oh shit, this isn't looking good. This isn't good. Ooh. There we go. Right, let's take this slowly. Uh, Long Brother, a little bit. Um... Sniper, the sniper trail was still there. Uh, yeah, I kind of do a bit, a little bit longer with that. I do like the animations of the Promethean weapons, um, and I like the law. I love the law for them actually. I just don't think they're very interesting to, to use. Um, they are basically just reskins of human slash covenant weapons, mostly human weapons. But I don't, I don't, I don't hate them though. I don't hate them, as some people do. There we go. Um, not really, Olatom. Not particularly. Um, that's one of the kind of sucky things about MCC on PC. The graphics options are, I'm going to be honest, terrible. Like, the graphics customization is terrible in this game. It's awful and it needs improving. So, not really, no. Uh, yeah, Madder. Spectre. The Spectre for me. I love the Spectre. Hey, 38. Hong Was that 38? Yeah, Hong Kong Dollars. Thank you, dude. You play quite well. Keep it up. Thanks, man. So, if you look quite good English, my favorite Halo game is Halo 4, which is the one released the latest. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. I'm, that English is good, dude. For real. It's good. It's very good. I appreciate the support, man. I really do. Legend. Yeah, I love Halo 4's story. Um, and Dominion, and Extraction, and Multiplayer. And Regicide as well. Regicide is sick as well. Halo 4 definitely had some really good, good parts. No. God, that looks so good. And off the background somewhere, Buck sailing in. And Alpha 9. Hengster with a 100 Swedish Kroner. Thank you, dude. Something I've been quite bummed about since Halo 4 is that Chief's armor hasn't been available in the multiplayer, particularly in H2A. I agree. If they lock Chief's armor out of Infinite. Yeah, I agree. I also hope that with Chief getting his old armor in Halo Infinite, we can finally use his Mark 6 mod in multiplayer in Halo Infinite. I really hope they put it in. I really do. Any cell will do. Fingers crossed. Why not toss him in with this lot? 
My belly aches. Kota, okay, thanks for the T-Bucks, dude. <laughs> I know that feeling, Kota. I need a weapon. This flash is said the way I like it. The higher ups have something special in mind. God, dude, high charity in H2A. I mean, it looks incredible in both, but it looks fucking stunning in H2A. Honor Guard is a... Kunal again with 100, dude. Thank you very much. Do you think Infinite will end with a setup for another trilogy? <sighs> Honestly, I don't know. Uh, right now, guessing how that game is going to end, I and mean, we don't even know what the story is. Um... I'd, I'd assume it's not going to be a cliffhanger after Halo 5. I reckon it's going to be quite resolute. Mercy. I have brought the incompetent. You may leave, Tartarus. But I thought... And take your brutes with you. Cock blocked. Release the prisoner. Oh, yeah, the crosshair is lowered, isn't it? I forgot about that. The only reason I did that earlier was because I was playing around with it, the and this game looks really weird with Senate and high field of view. Because we did the but ultimately field of view wrong. The terms of your execution are up to me. I am already dead. Indeed. You know where we are. The mausoleum of, of the, the Arbiter. Arbiter. Quite so. Here rests the vanguard of the great journey. Every Arbiter from first to last. Each one created and consumed in times of extraordinary crisis. Give us the law for all of them, please, 343. <laughs> please. Rebellion. Were it not for the Arbiters, the Covenant would Same, Stephen. I agree. Arbiter. I love that feature. Even on so cool. Knees. Halo's destruction was your error, and you rightly bear the blame. But the council was Trojan. Thanks for the two bucks, dude. Uh, Longsword. We know my favorite. No heretic. This is the true face of heresy, one who would subvert oh. our faith and incite rebellion. My boy says so. High Council. Our prophets are false. Open your eyes, my brothers. They will use the faith of our forefathers to bring ruin to us all. The great journey is. A this heretic and those who follow I need a weapon must be silenced slander of don't do it arbiter don't do what it what use am I I can no longer command ships lead troops into battle not as you are no but become, become the arbiter and you, you shall, shall be set, set for against this, this heresy can't remember my lines god damn it dude I have heard Leafy's back Tom I have Caesar versus Han, who shot first? Caesar versus Han versus Greedo. It's like an eternal loop of shooting first. What of the council? The tasks you must undertake as the arbiter are perilous, suicidal. You will die as each arbiter has before you. The council will have <laughs> their corpse. My pleasure, Fabian. Me too, dude. Just, I'm just watching this cutscene again after making that video. It's like, obviously I knew all that lore before, but after really diving into it for like a week, it's just like, fuck, dude. It's so sad. You hate to see it. I have played StarCraft before. Uh, not much, though. What would you have your Arbiter do? What would you have your Arbiter do? Please bring the Arbiter and Keith David back in Halo Infinite. Please, 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 please. When Don't forget about him. This fucking cutscene. On the blood of our fathers, on the blood of our sons, we swore to uphold the covenant. Even to our dying breath. Those who would break this oath are heretics. Worthy of neither pity nor mercy. Even now, they use our Lord's creation. Lives. We shall grind them into dust and continue our march to glorious salvation. This cutscene is fucking incredible. Honestly, my favorite, I think, like in Halo, like like full stop, easily. Dude, the Arbiter does look so good. Suits you, but it cannot hide that mark. Nothing, Nothing ever, ever will. will. You are the Arbiter, the will of the prophets. But these are my elites. Their lives matter to me. Yours does not. That makes two of us. Hmm. A 
ich kann es sehen. We'll be long gone before it arrives. Warriors, prepare for combat. That is the best cutscene in the entire franchise. Not even close. Kino, thanks for the 100, dude. Do you think Chief will die in Infinite? No, I'd, I would be shocked if he died, personally. Yeah, orange, I imagine, dude. I imagine orange Shader King is that, like... Everyone is minus a blood in 2004. Yeah, exactly, Kalina, let alone nowadays. That cutscene is honestly perfect. Camouflage. Reveal yourselves only after the Arbiter has joined battle with the enemy. I do, Tomb. Tomb, Tomb. I do, indeed. But take but heed. Your armor system is not as new as ours. This is such a good mission. It's hard to believe that people back in the day hated the Arbiter and playing as him. That was a failed attempt at stealth. I mean, I understand a bit why, but I don't know. It's it's like I, I can't imagine not liking the character of the Arbiter and playing as him. So good. It... So good. Yeah, Rasplez. Um, when Halo 2 came out, there were like quite a lot of people hated playing as the Arbiter, and they hated like um, trying not to not to. Have my least die. Um, they hated playing as the Arbiter, and they hated the entire like Arbiter like story within this game because it wasn't Chief. They also hated that the game ended with the Arbiter as well. I like I don't know, dude. Couldn't be me. Couldn't be me. Any audio shows like Hunt the Truth that you could recommend? Um. None that I know of, aside from Hunt the Truth, really. Which is, like, painful to listen to now, knowing that all of it is, like, useless and doesn't mean anything. Hang on, what's going on around here? Alright, we're good. I do, Cameron. I do watch him. Yeah, I agree, Jerry. Bungie, it did take a lot of balls to do this. And I'm very happy they did it. Sentinels, Holy Warriors of the Sacred Rings. Sentinels, the holy warriors of the sacred ring. Why have they sided with these heretics? Right, let's see if we can get a sword cancel off on this guy and go over. Nope. Oh, didn't that didn't break my camera somehow? Oh, almost. I'll have you know, chap. I used to have the fastest uh, speedrun time of this mission on easy on MCC on the leaderboards. I was number one for like a month, and then Monopoly came in and beat, beat my time by like 15 seconds, <laughs> which was always going to happen at some point. To be fair. Yeah, I, I agree, Steve. I hate the anniversary carbine as well. That sound is so nice, the, the original one. Like the two and three one. Hopefully infinite sounds like it. I won't hold my breath, but I'm hoping that it does. I just love everything Halo 2 Classic. 
everything about this game is perfect. It really is. Even though it's technically not perfect, it's still very perfect. Hello. Thank you for the free sword. I used to watch it negative. Um, well, I uh, my only real time watching um, Red versus Blue was back in like God 2003 maybe when it was on Google Videos before YouTube even existed. Um, that was how I found it, and I watched one of the seasons like well, not not like coherently, but like I, I watched quite a lot of the episodes of it way back then when I was like God what six seven. Cleansing Flume. Thank God Bungie forgot to add damage values for heretics, for the heretics melee in this game. Thank you, Bungie. Yeah, this car band sounds so much nicer to me. But the music's so fucking quiet in, Anna in Classic for some reason. It never was like this before, it was louder. Yeah, yeah. Oh boy, another spammer. Lovely. Let's just ban this guy real quick. There we go. What do I mainly want in Infinite? Um, classic gameplay. Uh, a good long story with a resolute ending. Um, of the quality of Halo 2. Uh, extremely heavy customization. What the fuck happened there? I think that I, I lunged into that heretic as our elite was meleeing him, I think. Uh, what else? I want a lot of things in infinite. <laughs> the list of what I want is basically never ending. A holes multiply. It does feel kind of bad killing all these guys, because, I mean, they're right. What they're doing is good. They're trying to save a lot of lives, and uh, we're just going through mercilessly killing them all. Feels bad, man. My god. What the? F that was kind of clutch, I'm not gonna lie. I stuttered halfway through, but. I'll take it. Bye. Thank you, Jason. I appreciate it. Welcome to the stream. Oh, okay. There we go. I am the reclaimer in infinite. You never know. You never know. I'm definitely not, but you never know. You never know. <laughs> oh shit. No, leave my precious Grunt alone. I've never had a Grunt survive this late in, in this mission. Holy shit. I actually kind of can't believe he's still alive. I'm pleasantly surprised. Is he alive? Oh no, he just, just kind of stood up. All right. <laughs> hey, Foxy, how's it going, dude? Welcome to the stream, dude. Nice try. Nice try with the melee. Connor Reed, thanks for the five bucks, dude. I'm playing this while you're playing it. What a coincidence. Exactly. Exactly. You're doing God's work, son. There's a frame perfect glitch. I'm not sure if it works actually on um 
on MCC, but in the original game, there's a frame perfect glitch you can do where you can sword lunge to the heretic leader through that window. I can get through it. I wish. Uh, yeah, it is Foxy. It is. Oh, this section with Incubus is so good. The Grunt actually survived to the end. You love to see it. All right, what's what's Banshee bombing this? Q. Okay. Is actually gonna play Incubus? Dude, it's so quiet. You can barely even hear it. They need to change that mixing. Like, I don't know why that happened with original MCC, but it's still a problem and it needs fixing. Is the... Are we going to move? Nope. Okay. <laughs> Kunal with a faulty. Thank you, dude. If Chief dies in infinite, I'm done with healer. I would not be... Uh, I would not be ready for that. It, Chief isn't... I, I, I would be shocked if they killed him off. Um, is there a reason the phantom isn't moving? Hello? Uh, 100% Crimson Doug. I will be, I will be absolutely streaming that over here on YouTube. Whenever it is. Hang on. I oh, no. no, no, no. I'll take it back. I thought some of the geometry hadn't loaded. Uh, okay, so the phantom is just stuck. <laughs> okay, everything's still spawning there. At least the Grimace are. Oh. Oh. Okay, follow did not sound like that before. Oh, okay, right. No, what the fuck have they done to that? Yeah. The Grimace must be yap yap. <laughs> Thanks for the two-foot curator. It might be, you know. You never know. Don't get me wrong. Breaking the Covenant by Misha Mansour is sick as fuck. But it's it's not... I don't know. In Incubus is just, like, perfect for this section. I need a weapon. I barely read chat, only super chat. I mean, it's like impossible to read every single comment, my dude. Uh, I get quite a lot in here. You got to focus on playing the game at the same time as well. Right, you know what? We're going to skip all that because that's clearly not working properly. Um... The fuck? Hello? I'm not going to question it. <laughs> I'm not going to question it. How is it running so far? Um, Not perfect, Ethan, but it's not unplayable by any means. It's, it's definitely playable. What is it? That stench. I I've smelt it before. Do I like Reach's campaign? Uh, I like the story. I don't like playing the campaign. Uh, I don't enjoy it personally. Do you think Open World and Infinite will be like ODST? Uh, I mean, if if the game is Open World, then that might be something to go for, like a Mombasa Street type thing. I'd be down for that. What is that? What is that? Oh, I've never heard him say that before. Never heard him say that before. <laughs> Fuck you, heretic leader. What happened? What happened here? I shall bind them shut. See 
you, heretic. This is such a cool little monologue here. I love it. I wondered who the prophets would send to silence me. An arbiter. I'm flattered. He's using a hollow throw. He must be close. <laughs> Sharky, Come thanks to two bucks, dude. It was necessary. <laughs> hey, Johnny, how's it going, dude? Welcome to the stream. I love that delivery on that line there. <laughs> Get in line. Sounds so good. I fucking love Cesar for me, man. Such an unfortunate end for his character. Although, like I said in my video, I do like to think that on some level, Cesar definitely got through to Arbiter. I mean, I think he, I think he definitely did. In cover. What the? That's weird. There's that one infection form stuck, not spawning or something. Sorry, sorry, Grint. Heretic fools. What have they done? Come on. Oh shit, no, 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 no. Ooh, okay. That was close. This section is quite something. Quite something. You think infinite will be better than four and five? I hope. I hope it is. I, I severely, severely hope that it is. Because uh, I was not a fan of neither Halo Four nor Halo Five. Fingers crossed. Let's just sway against the AI. <laughs> the only way I know how. So many years of playing Legendary and Halo 2 have conditioned me to play like this. Blame the Jackals, not me. <laughs> the hell was that? Hey, Connor Reed for the 10 bucks. Thank you, dude. I finished Hello Five of the day, and although I didn't like the story, the missions on Sanghelia is really fun to play through. Some of the best in FIFA 3. I do agree with that. I don't personally find them fun to play through, but I do think they are kind of cool missions. Um, I do wish they'd gone for like a bit of a, a bit less of like a deserty vibe with Sanghelia, like a bit less of like a ancient like Egyptian vibe, and more of like a jungle vibe kind of. Um, but the Sanghelia missions are definitely the highlight of Halo Five. I agree with that one, like 100%. Uh, they are night and day better than the rest of that campaign. Uh, and that, that arc in particular, the, the whole Arbiter arc in Halo 5 is my favourite in the entire game. I mean, I think, I think it is for most people, but it definitely is for me. So thank you for the 10 bucks, dude. And I agree. Flawless Cowboy, 2 bucks. Flood Gang. Flood Gang indeed. Thanks, dude. And Coat with the 2 bucks as well. My question, who gave Cat a driver's licence? Some drunk Oni operative. Some guy who had been drinking on the job at Oni. That's the only, uh... It's the only possible reason I could see for her having a driver license. Or she bribed somebody. Dude, these grunts, have they buffed them or something? Because they're actually staying alive for a long time. We still have two grunts alive. And we have everyone alive still. Both of those grunts usually die at the start. In the initial encounter. Kino, thanks for the 40, dude. What if Halo Infinite has a world like Destiny 2? I hope not. I, I don't like the way Destiny does its open worlds. Like, I hate having to go to a certain point in the world to go and, like, like do a mission. I just want to go to a fucking menu and, like, select it, you know? It's, it's annoying having to, like, actually go there. It's like what COD World War 2 tried with the social speeds. Like, menus are just objectively better and easier to use. And that game, COD World War 2, ended up completely abandoning its social speeds. Like, 
six minutes into launch. Like, it's, it's still there, but I need a weapon. it's basically dead because no one goes into it anymore. Everyone just uses the menus. What a shock. People want to use a menu. Imagine that. But yeah, thanks to the 40, dude. I appreciate it. So much. <laughs> uh, that the start of Halo Cannon's recent video, Chris, is pretty joke with that. How he had that at the start. That was a that was a good intro. I was a fan of that intro. I love this mission. Don't get me wrong, but you can definitely tell this section was made by Bungie to sort of like stretch the mission out a little bit, and the next section as well. Have I ever played Terraria? I have indeed. I played. I used to play Terraria a lot when it first came out. And I used to love it. I've not played it in a long time. I have been tempted to try it again, actually. But I've not played it in, like, a long-ass time. Oh, no. Rest in peace. Rest in peace, he says, as he melees the body of the Grunt. <laughs> yeah, this is very library-esque. I agree. I agree, Wisefish. Lovely. I do love the aesthetic, though. Very cool. No. Leave the elites alone. Oh, bitter. Oh, shit, we're here. Dude, you are not killing the Grunt right at the end. I've never had a Grunt come this far with me. Kota, thanks for the two bucks, dude. I feel like I spent half my life in that elevator. Yeah, I, I reckon I've already spent, like, at least 24 hours on this elevator before. I could find tired lifespan. We should have brought weapons to burn these bodies. Dude. Every one I'm in awe of this of this grin. Like as if he survived this long. Have a place of Nautica. No, I haven't a spilling coops. Thanks for the two bucks, by the way, dude. Um no I haven't, and I want to try it in VR really bad. It looks like a really good VR game. Do I like pickles? I do. I love pickles. Pickles are very good. I'm not gonna lie, I prefer the ambience in Halo 2 Classic here over the, the soundtrack of H2A. I need a weapon. Try and get up here. Oh no, fuck I just messed up. I agree, Terran. I hope so as well. Does this update add new nameplates? Uh, I'm not sure. I've not checked yet. Maybe? Although, to be fair, they didn't add any more for CE. So, I don't know if they're going to add any, any more for Halo 2. Where's that Grunt? Don't you dare tell me that Grunt is dead. I will never forgive you, Halo 2. Where is he? I've got a bad feeling, chat. I think I think we lost him. I think we lost him. I will never forgive you, Halo 2. Uh, I think I genuinely don't know. Like, I, I honestly don't even know if it's in the game. I don't think it is. Uh... We'll have to wait and see. I don't even know if they added H2A Forge with this. Honestly. I need a weapon. Grin is dead. Rest in peace. 64 shot AR or 60 shot AR. Not 64. 60 shot is uh, the chieftain. That is the, the king of ARs. Oh no. Fuck. Rest in peace elite. Only the strongest will survive. Yeah. 
Have I ever played Five Nights at Freddy's? When it first came out, God knows how long ago, I played it like once and it was like, it was alright. It was alright, I guess. I don't understand for the life of me how that game has such an insanely, absurdly massive following, but, you know, some things just happen. Right, come on, Elite. Get off the turret. This Elite always gets in the turret at the end. Every time. Come on, off the turret. No, there's a carrier form right behind you. Come on. I missed a super chat. I fucking did, didn't I? Sergeant Steam, thanks for the five quid, dude. Love your content. What are your thoughts on the Leech versus Brutes? Oh. The fuck has happened to the game? Uh, what do the Elites have over the Brutes, despite the Brutes' physical advantages? Uh, wisdom, I would say. Um, combat proficiency. Uh, intelligence. It appears Halo 2 has crashed. <sighs> Completely black screened. Um, Alright. That's sick. Thank you, MCC. Stable update, by the way. Um, let's, uh, let's try that again. Uh, yeah, Sergeant, Sergeant um, Steam. Definitely uh, intelligence and combat proficiency. This doesn't happen on OG Xbox. No, it doesn't. You're right. <sighs> yeah, something tells me this should not have been released yet. Um... Something tells me that this should not have been released. Thank you very much, Ephraim. I appreciate that, dude. Hopefully, it actually saved the checkpoint. I really, really hope that it did. Okay, it did, I think. Let's try again. Hopefully, it doesn't crash this time. There we go. I was worried we're going to have to replay the entire fucking mission. And of all the missions to have us replay, this would be like the one that you don't want it to happen. I can honestly say that I don't think I've ever had Halo 2 crash on the OG Xbox. I might have gotten lucky, but I can honestly say that I've never had that happen. Come on, Elite. I don't want to have to leave you behind. Kuno with the 40 again. What if Infinite ends with the third reveal? Uh, I've kind of theorized about that for a while now. I would not be against it by any means. Elite. There we go. Come on. Don't get on the turret. Just in case. I need a weapon. I hope so, Fancy Turtle. I'd like to think so. Right, come here. There's nothing as fun as sword flying in Halo 2. I'm yet to find anything as fun as that. Kota with the T-Bus again. Only so far from 2001 can be better than 2020. Yeah. Um, something's certainly up. That's the, that, to be fair, that is the only game-breaking bug we've had so far. That's the first one. Um, still, it's, it shouldn't be there. Um... I need a weapon. Having problems like that don't launch the game. But you know. You know. Uh, Jason, yes it will be. That fucking heretic just got yeeted, dude. Surrounded by five minute of overpowered controller aim assist. Yeah, pretty much. That about sums MCC up. The f Where's he off to? Took a little tumble off the cliff. I need a Come here. Connor Reed, thanks for the five bucks, dude. Uh, is it possible the main villain of Infinite will be the Banished after the Prometheans are taken care of? I would imagine so, yeah. I reckon that's what, can be what happens. Thanks for the five bucks, man. I appreciate it. And also, Evil Frog. <laughs> the fucking alien Pepe. 
More than likely, they released the, released the whole people over until July. Maybe, yeah. Either way, I wish they didn't do it, but here we are. Thanks for the five bucks, they did. I appreciate it. I appreciate it greatly. This will save, save me from the storm. Hi, <laughs> I'm ahead out. I need a weapon. Stinking blood they box themselves in tight. We'll never break through this. Then we shall force him out. How? The cable. I'm going I'm to cut it. Cut it. <laughs> it was indeed every. Someone got it. Get everyone back to the Somebody team. got the reference. <laughs> Good old Sharky. Tuck a little tumble off the cliff. Okay, right, we're doing the invincibility glitch this time. I forgot to do it on the last Halo 2 stream, but this time we're doing it. Oh shit. Ooh. That was a close one. Super bounce, pretty much. When do you think Halo 3 fights will come out? Honestly, I don't know. Um, it depends how fast they can get past like Ring 1 and Ring 2 testing. Um, and how many blocker bugs they find in that. Oh. Um, did they break the, the glitch? That's been there since day one of Halo 2 in 2004 that's used by speedrunners in every single Halo 2 speedrun. Did they please tell me they didn't break it? Oh. I really hope that it does work still because that, that glitch is like really, really, really crucial to Halo 2 speedruns. Right, can you? Yeah, off you go. Can we not do that? That foot is going up. Right, I'm not going to crouch. I normally... Oh my fucking god, dude. I swear to god, if they fixed it. If they all didn't even fix it. By the looks of it, they just kind of broke it. I really, really, really hope they didn't. I'm going to be a little bit mad if they, if they did that. I'm not going to lie. Thank god the damage is bugged on uh, Sword Sword and Halo 2. Or not. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Yeah, please don't spam. If you, if you spam in the chat, you are just going to get banned. It ain't worth it, son. Can I have your sword, please? Thank you. Of all the, yeah, if they actually, of all the things that they fix, it's a glitch that everyone wants. Hey, Alex, thanks for 10 bucks again, dude. So, funny question for you. I know British people can talk in American voice. Oh, God. Okay, I used to be really, really good at accents, right? Like, really good, but it's kind of faded over the years. Hey, guys, welcome back. That sounds way too fucking... There we go. They didn't fix it. Lovely. Uh, I'm just going to do a little super bounce here, uh, float up through the sky, and uh, get the invincibility glitch, you know? Uh, pretty cool, man. Pretty cool. That's my attempt. <laughs> That's my attempt at an American accent. I apologize to any Americans I offended with that. Sorry, but not sorry. Oh, fuck. Dude, all the way back. Fuck me, man. <laughs> Jacob, what's up, dude? How's it going? Yeah, that wasn't the greatest uh, American accent. Right, you know what? Fuck it. That sword elite can just not give me his sword. At least you know this, this glitch isn't fixed. You just can't crouch anymore. My American accent is adorable. Thank you very much. Oh. Oh. The game does not want me to get past this section. I 
I'll take, tell you what. May as well take the sword. Dude, come on. Fucking BT, fix your shit. Oh, why? Alright, hopefully that'll fix it. Hang on, one sec. We back? We back? Are we good? Are we good? Are we back? I think we might be back. Right, we're back. Okay, good. <laughs> Fucking BT, dude. This... This has been a persistent problem now for God knows how long. And they didn't do anything about it, which is always great. Right. Try again. Now we've got to jump at the perfect time. The return of the king. <laughs> one final cable oh wait, there's one more cable? Oh yeah, whoops. Nah, it's not you guys, don't worry. My internet has been being complete dog shit for like the past week. <laughs> oh my god, negative one. I'll take that, you know, I'm not going to complain. I'm not going to complain about that. I'll take it. Right, I'm going to jump at the perfect time, or I'm... Fuck. I need to re... Don't... Right, you know what, chat? We're not doing that glitch. Fuck it. It's not worth it. It ain't worth it. The frame rate's gone. It's fine on my end. Try refreshing the stream. Okay, right, I'll tell you what, one more attempt. One more attempt. It's, I always forget when you have to jump at the end. Dude, can we not knock me off? One more attempt. We're back. We back indeed. We're back. Now that crash was uh, was my internet, not the game. And bounce me. Oh, almost off the edge then. That was uh that was close. That was very close. Been down for two weeks, my god, that would I literally, if that was me, I literally would not be able to do my job. I mean, to be fair, that would be most people right now with lockdown. Yeah, I don't know why we didn't get a checkpoint up here. Probably because I did the, the lift skip, honestly. This is speedrun. No, it's not. I just like doing uh, speedrunner strats, honestly. Let's try not to fuck this up this time. Pull, pull, pull. Okay, I think we got it. We got it. There we go. Last time for the charm. You just gotta not jump. Oh, there we go. I love this glitch. Got like zero G and invincibility platform be like I'm a head out. <laughs> we can just slowly float down here at our own pace. Just float down. Nice and calm. We can 
just flow through the middle. <laughs> this is oh, I love this. I love this glitch. Lovely. Oh, the Banshee sounds so sick there. It doesn't sound quite like what I'd like the Banshee to sound like, but it still sounds so cool. Right. Time for the, the smallest gameplay section of any game ever. Just fly. Barbara, you know what to do. Oh really, Sir King? I wasn't sure. I didn't know you could do that. This glitch is like a savior on Legendary for this section. It makes this section so much better. I'm pretty sure the gravity's fixed. Yeah, it is. And I'm just completely invincible. I believe even even to my grenades. Yeah. Yeah, love to see it. You can't beat a bit of tea. Uh, this version has stuff like uh, field of view mod changing, and it's also on PC, so you can play keyboard and mouse. Um, and at higher refresh rates as well. Yeah, those, those cables can, like, fucking yeet you if they hit you the wrong way. Who's ready for the the longest, most tedious boss fight in Halo history? Any minute now. Just gonna try and zoom past these guys. Do not be hasty. Thank you, Earth. I appreciate it, dude. Right, who's ready for the longest boss fight in gaming history? The longest one. Arbiter, I would rather die by your hand than let the prophets lead me to slaughter. Who has taught you these lies? Who has taught you these lies? The Oracle. Hello, I am 343 Guilty Spark. I am the monitor of <laughs> Ask the Oracle about Halo. How they would sacrifice us all for nothing. More questions? Splendid. I would be happy to assist you. Oh. But who shot first, though? That's the real question, lads. Who shot first? The elites, the elites are lying. Are blind, but I. That's such a cool scene. Stream's breaking again. Is it lagging? Ah, oh, dude. It's fine on my end. There you are, say so. What a boss fight. My god, that is that is a boss fight. His edification was most enjoyable. I had no choice, Holy Oracle. This heretic imperiled the Great Journey. Oracle? Great Journey? Why do you meddlers insist on using such inaccurate words? <laughs> oh, 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 oh. We're back now. Okay, good. That is the Oracle. That so is the is. Oracle. Come, we are leaving this system. I hope so too, Alex. I hope so too. The one silver lining is that Pablo Schreiber was a very good Casper Chief. That's the one thing that I will I will happily say is good about that show. He was a good Casper Chief. Uh, are we going to load? MCC. We're trying to play Delta Halo. Are we going to load? There we go. Took his sweet time. 
Thank you very much, JC Gaming. I appreciate it, dude. Report! Both engine cores have spun to zero. We're drifting. Archer pods are cold. I'll need to rekey the system. Do it and find out where we are. Sorry for the quick jump, Sergeant. You in one piece? I'm, I'm good. good. Yeah. Chief? We're fine. Ma'am, there's an object. Coming into view now. Quartana. So this is what my father's what exactly found. My father found. Not father's. That is another Halo. What? Say what? Say what? So this is what my father found. I thought Halo was some sort of super weapon. It is. If activated, this ring will cause destruction on a galactic scale. I want the information you've got on the first Halo. Schematic, topography, whatever. I don't care. Okay, so thanks for the T-Bucks, dude. Ta ta. Where's our target? The enemy ship has stopped above the ring, ma'am. We're going to pass right over it. Perfect. Given what we know you got the spearhead video. I think I think it is, isn't it? Hey, yeah, it is. Find out why he came to Earth. Why he came here. Chief, take oh. the Hard drop. Secure landing zone. Sergeant, load up two flights of pelicans and follow them in. Aye, aye, ma'am. Like I need a weapon. Flight, I'm going to keep a low profile. Keep a when low you profile. Ship, you're on your own. Understood. Over the target in five. This is such a cool cutscene. Hang on to your helmet. <laughs> Thank you, Kevin. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Kevin's top five. That must be so fucking terrifying going in on in an ODST part, dude. <laughs> I've got a feeling that would hurt a lot. Inside the ruins, the textures are broken. Oh god, really? Could we possibly make any more noise? Yes. I guess so. Uh, are we back? Okay, I think we're back. Right, we're back. Okay. Yeah, sorry about this, guys. My internet is being complete dog shit um, at the moment. When I was streaming last night over on Twitch, I had to literally stop the stream because it was crashing so often. Hopefully, I don't have to do that today. I'm hoping. I don't want to have to stop the stream. I want to do this entire thing in one sitting. Um... But when your ISP is being a fucking idiot, there's not much you can do, <laughs> unfortunately. Alright, let's have a look at these broken textures then. Huh? Artillery disabled, Sergeant. Landing zone secure for the moment. Looks fine for me. I hear you. Starting our approach. Hang tight. Looks pretty fine for me, honestly. <laughs> Have an SMG in a sprint. Definitely not. No. Inside. Textures look fine to me. I'm not grabbing an SMG and I can't sprint. Thank God. Come on. There we go. Wasted, Sarge. Wasted. Uh, yeah, it's fine on my end, uh, Thomas. There's, there's no issue here. Textures are fine. That's a cool sound. I've never heard that before. Another phantom. 
<laughs> okay. That was quite disgusting, I'm not gonna lie, dude. <laughs> this covenant did not stand a chance. Hey, Fletch, how's it going, dude? Welcome to the stream. Thank you, Johnny. I'm glad you liked it, dude. A video is fun to make. Not bad. Currently suffering from a fucking plethora of internet issues. Um, which is making streaming a bit difficult. But other than that, not bad. Not bad. I love this animation when you kill a jackal in classic. God, this, this stuttering is... Uh, a bit yikes. Just a little bit. There's one more something around here. Or not. <laughs> Maybe not. BT. And they are no S bueno. No S bueno at all. Until the pelican arrives, Chief. With pleasure. Is there actually a pilot in there? There's, there's not, is there? There's no one actually. There's no one actually flying that. I'm gonna switch soon, Fletch, to somebody because BT's fucking. Garbage. Garbage. I got a good view DB Geeks videos are cool. They're good. In the of this lake. I'm a fan. I saw it too. It looked like a temple. If I were a megalomaniac... And I'm not. Well, you are now, unfortunately, because... Uh... <laughs> Nobody needs hubcaps, right? Hubcaps are kind of pointless. How did I become invincible? Uh, on Oracle, you uh, have to launch yourself up, up. with the uh, with the elevator and then jump back down. All right, anyway, Fletch, enjoy your stream, dude. Good to have you with us, sir. Cheers for stopping by. I don't like the Halo 2 anniversary Warthog, but I do like the sound. The sound is pretty good. That was incredible, wasn't it? Dear Sarge. I love all the little comedic moments like that. That just aren't, aren't like in Halo anymore. Like at all. You hate to see it. Prayers for infinite to bring it all back. Bye. Okay, surely that's a, that's a decent place, right? You can survive their marines or ODSTs. There is another launch you can do. Um... With the the bridge, but it's kind of hard, and I can't remember how you meant to do it. Hey, Kota, thanks for the two bucks, dude. Who would win, Chief Pride or the your head? <laughs> Always Chief. I like how this is actually like a like an actual model of truth, like you can melee to him. I'm gonna try that launch real quick. I've not done it in a long time, but I know you can do it. Nope, fuck it up. <laughs> Maybe not. Is this the Steam version? Yes, it is, Mad Rod. This is the Steam version. Oh, they actually survived. Holy shit. Hang on, is that an elite in the... No. Okay, I thought an elite was in the Warhog then. Maybe he was in the Warhog. <laughs> How's quarantine treating you? It's not bad. It's alright. I'm pretty much used to it anyway. This is like... 
how I live life most mostly anyway, so it's not really that different. Uh, thanks for asking there, dude. Extremely resilient. Extremely. <laughs> okay, bye. Bye. Which Halo Scorpion is the best? Uh, Halo Reaches or Halo Fours? Or Halo Two Anniversaries for me, personally. I really like all those Scorpions. Do I have a favorite band? Uh, I have a lot of bands that I love. Um, I don't know. I couldn't really pick a number one. Evanescence. Uh, fuck. Evanescence, Oasis. Oh. Deftones are really good. Breaking Benjamin because of this fucking game. Um, uh, God, what else? Low Roar are really good. Um, I, I have a lot of... I, I don't think I could really pick a one favourite. I'm playing on normal, uh, Tim. I do like the aesthetic scorpion lights on this, even if these areas are maybe a little bit too dark. You break it, you buy it. Okay. Last time we streamed this mission, <laughs> I got destroyed here for like a solid 15 minutes. I'm not going to let that happen again. Okay, we actually have the UDS TV now, so hopefully they'll uh, be useful. With the Flood Infect Engineers, uh, they're technically not organic, so probably not, no. Uh, I don't know, actually. I made a video about this a few years ago, and I can't remember what I said. <laughs> Thanks for the two bucks, dude. I appreciate it. Connor Reed with the five bucks again. Would you agree with this ranking of Halos? Uh, Halos. Halo 2, 3, C, 4, Reach 5, ODST. Um, mine is a bit different to that. That's not too far off mine, though. Mine is Halo 2, Halo CE, Halo 3, ODST, Reach 4, 5. I need a weapon. Oh yeah, Slipknot. Another one. And Slipknot and the System of a Down as well. Two of my other favorite bands. I right, go on ODSDs, you can, you can go ahead for me. Clear the way. Poor Elite. Should we get the skull? I'm pretty sure the schools on this actually show up on all difficulties. Because we got blind earlier and we're only playing on normal. So, uh, yeah, we'll get the get the Envy skull, I think. Like, over there. I just, I just tried to ping over there like I'm playing Warzone. Jesus, dude. We'll get it. Okay, hopefully those ODSTs can handle those, uh, other ghosts. Whilst I go and pick up this random person's skull. Right, I believe you need jump. Alright, that was weird. I might even try rocket jumping, actually. I don't know if it's going to kill me. I didn't mean to shoot the rock. Where are we? Okay, we're not too far back. Do I have all the achievements in Halo? Uh, no, I don't. Because I don't have the time nor patience to do lasso. And I, I never will do. Lasso achievements are some achievements that I will genuinely never... I, I, I know for a fact I will never do. Um... I just I don't have the time or the page or more more so the patience to do lasso. Lasso is a, a serious serious undertaking, and I don't <laughs> I don't even want to try it. I've tried it before, and it I didn't enjoy it, and I don't want to try it again. It was hell. 
Code with the two bucks. Thank you very much, dude. Puppy choice. I love Warzone. I love, yeah, dude, I love Warzone as well. Warzone is my favorite battle royale. Like, quite easily. I love Apex as well. But Warzone is definitely my favorite. Okay, let's try again. Warzone is definitely my favorite. Did the knees just fall I through that. Weapon. Yeah, they, okay. Can jump on here, though. Now, I believe the elites should be up there. Doid! Nicholas, welcome, dude. Okay, maybe not. I think it's over here, isn't it? I'm pretty sure it's up here. Uh. Oh, it's in. Okay, maybe not. Maybe I'm getting it wrong. Remember when Halo had a mode called Warzone? <laughs> Unfortunately, yes. I do remember that. Unfortunately. They're all pouring out of the middle. There we Let's go. I was there. waiting for them to spawn. Zoom. No. Dude, doid. Okay, thank god. We actually got a good checkpoint for once. Halo Evolve, thanks for the two Australian books, dude. I thought it was a legendary only. Yeah, I think um, the regular ones are, I think. Um, it's just like the blind one and stuff that aren't. The silver schools, isn't they called? Hey, Alex, thanks for the ten books, dude. Again, is it a for sure thing bias will be an infinite? No, it's not, unfortunately. I wish it was, but uh, it's not. It is not. Hang on, why's the pelican? Oh, okay. I need a weapon. Will there be a caught on or two? I don't know. Maybe. We'll have to wait and see, I guess. I'm hoping not, but I don't know. I'll have to wait and see. I might try and go a different way, actually. I can... Okay, no, I can't. I love Halo 5 Warzone. Oh, war... the oh, Halo 5 Warzone, did you mean? Thanks for the T-Bucks, Kota. I uh, I personally wasn't a fan. I, I didn't really like Warzone. Um, it was what? I need a weapon. Oh, that is a good checkpoint right there. To me, it's clear that Two Four Three sacrificed BTB for Warzone just so they could monetize it. And I, I mean, I don't enjoy Warzone anyway, but I, that maybe enjoy it even less. But it's got a niche community. I I, I understand why, why people do enjoy it. It's just not for me really. I'm not a fan. Can I get up there? No. Oh my god! Almost splattered him with that with the debris of that like chair thing. Did the Covenant use human weapons? Uh, no. Brutes favoured them sometimes, but they didn't use them. Hello. There we go. You think firefight, actual firefight, will be brought back, brought back in infinite? Um, probably. Yeah, I have a feeling they will do. I'm not really bothered either way because I, I don't actually like firefight. Um, very, very unpopular opinion, I know, but I'm, I'm I don't really. Enjoy Firefight personally, like any iteration of it. I mean, Warzone Firefight was easily the worst version. Um, but I don't know. I don't. I just don't really think Firefight is a very fun horde mode. I'd much rather play like Gears Horde or something or Zombies than Firefight personally. Terminus Firefight in Halo Wars 2 was really good. That was a good mode. That was the best Firefight mode in my opinion. My god, that drone is just like a 360 mid air. I need a weapon. Heresy. <laughs> yeah, I mean I, I expected that. But I don't know, I just I personally am not a fan of Firefight. I wanted to come back because I know that a lot of other people wanted to come back. 
Uh, but if it, if it didn't come back, personally, I wouldn't really care. Um, but I understand that a lot of people would do, so I hope they do bring it back. Boyd. Favorite Halo 2 level, Uprising. Definitely, definitely Uprising. Good. Still no word about in Amber Clad and the Covenant Family. It's odd. The Covenant I need a weapon. Should we get on the roof? Yeah, let's get on the roof. Let's go this separate way. Is high charity the best? Uh, thank you for the two bucks, Connor Reed. Uh, personally, I love Uprising. Uprising is my favorite by quite a long shot. I mean, I love this campaign, but Uprising is the one mission that I love over the rest of them. Let's go the alternate route. Oh, hang on. Just realized that I can't because I don't have boom on. Or not boom, what's it called? Feather. I think it is. <laughs> Don't ask campaign dialogue. Watch yourself, honor guard. That was swift. We both missed there. Where's that plasma rifle one? Look how they massacred my boy. He's supposed to have two plasma rifles, not one. Now that average bear, I would love. I would love that. Lord Gore, thanks for the five bucks, dude. How many second graders do you think could be here before they take you out? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. That's a strange question that I could honestly say that I've never been asked before. Um, <laughs> let's go for... I don't know. Seven. The, the Halo number. <laughs> Thanks for the five bucks, dude. I need a weapon. Are you sure? Pretty much. Commander, we've got a problem. we got a problem. But from what I understand, the Prophet will need an object, the Index, to activate the ring. I've located a library similar to the one you found on oh, the first Oh, a game. library. If the Look rings work the same way, the Index should be inside. I hope so, Ash. I hope so. Then we better beat them to it, Sergeant. Extract your men and meet me at the library. I hope Battle Royale is an infinite, and I hope they do it like Warzone, where it's like its own separate thing and doesn't replace any feature in the game. Um... Because, like, Warzone in Halo 5, the biggest issue with that was it was very clearly meant to be, like, a replacement for BTB. And that's stupid. Like, don't do that. God, that was bad. Jesus. Um, with The way that Infinity Ward have handled Warzone as, like, an, its own separate entity is really good, in my opinion. And if, if Halo was to do Battle Royale like that, it would... I genuinely believe it would be, it would be massive for the Halo as a franchise. It would be fucking huge. Dude, this stuttering is bad on me. Can you guys see this? That's rough. You know, I think the forerunners built these new structures around the old to protect them, honor them. Hmm. Maybe. Mind you. I need to make a thorough survey. What are you doing there? I'm trusting a bit risky here. Oh, fuck that. <laughs> no chance. <laughs> yeah, hey, Shui does seem to be stuttering a fair bit. It's only at the start of missions, though, for some reason. It never happens during a mission. It's only at the start. Nice try. <laughs> he just went berserk, but didn't have a sword to pull out. Poor guy. Poor miner. You hate to see it. Oh, my God. I'm using keyboard and mouse, Alex. So here's a fun fact, right? Oh, that was pixels away from me. I didn't realize until MCC came out that you didn't jump across here. Literally from like 2004 to 2014, I was jumping across there. I didn't realize you could get around. Hey, Michael Fino, welcome back, dude. Thanks for the five bucks. What's your favorite Halo 3 level? For me, it's the Covenant, which is the best. Yeah, I agree. Covenant, definitely. The Covenant is like a masterpiece of a level. I agree wholeheartedly. Thanks for the five bucks, dude. And go with the T-Bucks again. Imagine doing a Wasp Dash Banshee running infinite. 
Uh, I'd rather do something like a like a falcon run or something. That'd be kind of sick. I would love that. Um, thank you much for the, for the donation, my dude. Daniel Sondervold with a 999. Thank you, dude. Quick question. Do you know anything about why the UNSCN rebels were fighting before the war? Is there any lore about, why they, about it? Was the UNSC kind of like this empire? Yes, a little bit. So, not so much like the empire. Um, the UNSC was seen as really oppressive to the outer colonies. Uh, like the, U the UNSC and, and also the, the UEG, the United Earth Government, were seen as really oppressive and like quite fascist by a lot of the, out like the outer colonies. And they didn't want to be ruled by them. And that's basically the main source of it. Uh, thank you for the 10 bucks there, dude. And £5 pounds from Jaden Abraham as well. Uprising is a total of 11 allies. I love trying to keep them all alive. Even the grin. Same, dude. Same. I love to as well. I did not know I had 11. Um, but I'm the same as well. I, I always try and keep at least the elites alive. Uh, I love keeping them alive. Thank you for the donations, fellas. I appreciate it. Melted. I have to talk so fast to keep up. <laughs> I need to resize my uh, pop-out chat box. Honestly, it's a bit small. I need to make it bigger. But tabbing out, this game, I've noticed, does not like tabbing out at all. So doing that is like asking for the game to crash. Or at least H2A doesn't like tabbing out. Where's that Jackal Sniper? There's a beam. There it is. Where did he drop his beam rifle? Oh no, that was one that I dropped. Oh, I've got one. Look at that for an angle. The only two hunter encounters so far have just been one shots. <laughs> I don't want to give away my position, so Good evening, I'm rerouting Welcome to stream. stragglers back to you. I apologize. These pelicans are all the support you're going to get. Understood, ma'am. <laughs> Thank you very much, Coopin. I appreciate that, man. I appreciate that, that a lot. That's, uh, that's very nice to hear. I'm happy that you enjoy my content. Gonna go now, but have fun with the rest of the campaign. It was fun tuning in. Thank you very much, Orange. I appreciate it, man. Thank you for stopping by. I'll see you in the next one. Have a good night, man. I agree, uh, Cannibal Man. I agree wholeheartedly. I would love to see more Spartan versus Elite moves. I really feel like Invasion was like just the tip of the iceberg. I'm going to take the Carbon, actually. Whoa. Do you think Sprint will be an infinite? I love you, man. Thank you very much, Big Chingus. Thanks for the three bucks, dude. Uh, unfortunately, yes, I do. Um, as much as it pains me to the very core of my soul to say that, uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure it will be. I'm more than open to a surprise, but I don't expect to be surprised in regards to that. It's going to be in the game. Uh, which, is, which sucks, but I mean... Oh, shit. I don't know. What can you do? Apart from complain. Which I absolutely will do when, it, when we end up seeing it. Make a Halo, Halo Game Collector Edition lore video. Ooh, that's not actually a bad idea, Dinosaur Nugget. Thanks for the two bucks, dude. I appreciate it. That's actually not a bad idea. So now Halo 2 had conversations from the universe. Halo 3 had the Bisterium. Uh, Reach obviously had Horsey's Journal. And Halo 4 had a little Spartan 4 stuff. It's not a bad idea. Michael Fina, thank you for the 10 bucks again, dude. I appreciate it. If you could have a game set in the Halo universe, but in a new genre of game, what genre do you think would work well? Maybe an Uncharted, like Exploring Fallen Ruins. Super hype for your stream, by the way. Thank you, dude. I appreciate it. Personally, I would love to see... I mean, it's, it's like the most cliche answer, but I'm going to give it a flood horror game. It's like the universe is so set up for it. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Were you yeah, dude, Flood Horror is, like, begging to be made. It baffles me that we've never had that. And I really hope that's the first thing that people 3 do with, um, with spin-offs. After Halo Infinite. I really do. Here 
Do I play on legendary? Uh, nah, this is normal. Oh, there's another. Hang on. I thought I got them all. Just fast melee at nothing. Exactly, Kira. Thanks to T-Bucks, man. Exactly. Just QF, QF, QF. Right in doubt. Spam melee. What was Lord Hood doing d during Halo 4 and Halo 5? Uh, a lot, I think, if I remember rightly, a lot of political stuff. And the thing on the back of his head is a neural link. Um, which, like, connects to his brain. Uh, Long Brother, I did a little bit, I say it's not really a proper return, but I did go back to it for Mythic. Um, and I don't know, Mythic, the maps were really good, but the game just, the fact that it, the, the, the playlist was in Halo 5 ruined it for me. The aim assist and bullet magnetism were just, oh my god, painful. Painful, 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 not fun to play. The maps were great and it really sucks because all the things that the Mythic team had done was really were really good. They were just dampened by Halo 5. I prefer tea, Mr. Beaver, uh, personally. Only just though, I love tea and coffee. Hello, do you wanna? There we go. What game do I play the most? Right now, Warzone. Um, right now, either Warzone or any Resident Evil game. Bendejo. <laughs> what the? That's a tanky jackal. Is that Grim working up yet? There he is. Do I do Halo Customs? Not very often, no. Um, I mean, when Infinite comes out, I will do, provided that game has good custom games. But right now, not much, no. Um, I've kind of played them all to death, really, and I don't really... I don't know. I I've played, like, 90% of Halo Custom games so much. I just sort of get a bit bored of doing them now. Lord Gore, thanks for the two bucks, dude. Uh, how far do you think you could throw an orange? Uh, I'm going to go for 25 meters. Quite far. Thank you, dude. Game of Steel, what's your opinion on the May 7th event? Uh, lame. <laughs> lame, to put it lightly. Um, they didn't show any actual gameplay. They literally clickbaited the entire stream. Uh, that was handled very, very badly, in my opinion. They could have done it a lot better. Uh, I'm looking forward to the July one, though. Whenever the hell it's going to be. Come on, Marines. What's my highest round of zombies? I believe I got to I round 100 and 105 on Shinonuma. I'm at war. That's my record. Halo Wars 2 was set after Halo 5. Am I still on the Halo Amino? Uh, I think so, yeah. I mean, I've not had the Amino up for a while, but I think I am. <laughs> You're right behind me. Good luck catching up, Relics. Accepted a secure transmission from Regret's carrier to something called High Charity. High Charity. It seems to be a formal apology to the prophets of truth and mercy. Favorite Jonathan is H2I, definitely. Regret jumped the gun when he attacked Earth. He's asking the other prophets to forgive. Thank you, Copen. I appreciate that. Rival, arguing that no human presence was foretold. I do put a lot of um. So few ships in his fleet. I like Cawthon to finish. Odd, a prophet would have such bad intel about his enemy's homeworld. Those ruins are so cool. I love those stone ruins. I really hope we get more on it in Infinite. It's sacrilege that they're only in Halo 2. Um, yeah, I put a lot of time into the scripting and like working on the flow of my videos, so that's that's good to hear. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate that. Hey, you, uh, mind pointing it somewhere else too? <laughs> um, unfortunately, definitely not Dakota. <laughs> I wish. Legendary ostrich, five bucks. Thank you, dude. Have you ever wondered about being a Covenant civilian on High Charity while the flood was infecting it? Should you make a special level? I've been a advocating for a, a horror game. I need a weapon. In that vein, in the lower districts of High Charity during the flood invasion for so long, I'd love to see it. A 
I should be saving that. Actually, no, I shouldn't. I shouldn't be saving it. But what am I on about? There's Jackal Snipers through here. I don't need to save it for the Hunters. How's the performance? Um, it stutters quite a lot at the start of missions. Um, it's fine during missions. That's the weird thing. It, it, I don't, it might just be like when it's loading in all the textures and stuff for the mission. Uh oh. I'm not particularly sure. Um, but at the start of the missions, it can be quite rough. Start of regret, this mission in particular was very rough. Um, but it got better after like a few minutes. So it's by no means perfect, but it's not like completely broken. I've only had one game breaking bug so far, and that's um, the game crashing when I tabbed out. Keep it up, sir. Hello, where are you? Wow, Stacker, you crouch at the perfect time then, my dude. No, that was the first hunter that I didn't one-shot this entire run. Oh, shit. Ooh, yikes. Goddamn buggers. This is a bit risky here, actually. Thank you, Nathaniel. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Gamer of Steel, five bucks. Thank you, dude. What do you think the Primordial said to the ancient humans that made them want to kill themselves? I mean, in um, in Primordium, it pretty much says that you just told them like the the horrifying truth of the flood, and like why the flood are basically like infinite, and what they do to people when they infect them. And I'm pretty sure that just made them want to kill themselves. Hey, Lord Gob, Lord Gob, thanks for the membership, dude. I appreciate it. Welcome. Thank you, Casual Gamer. I appreciate that, man. Favorite character besides the Chief? Um, I can never decide. Either Arbiter or Mendicant Bias or the Primordial. I want to say Mendicant. Oh, dude, imagine training your entire life to become a Spec Ops Elite and just getting, like, flick shot like that. Hate to see it. Michael Fino, thanks for the five bucks, dude. Opinion on Halo boss fights. Um, Regret's pretty good. Tartarus is pretty good. Warden is bad. Caesar FMA is not amazing. Um, Spark in Halo 3 was, I mean, all right. Not terrible. It was all right. Uh, not terrible. Not terrible. Oh, we lost a Marine. We're officially a Marine down. The Precursors were stronger and smarter, arguably, than the uh, the Flood. Well, I say that. They're probably about the same, actually, because they are basically the same thing. No, Noble Six is definitely not alive. Regret's carrier just received a response from High Charity. A very well encrypted message. Shit, Alex, another 10 books, my dude. Thank you very much. Listen, very generous today. Now, I know that ancient humanity and Sanchayum used to be alive. What happened? Um, so, the homeworld of the ancient, ancient Sanchayum had a halo test fight on it. Um, Janja Kwam. Uh, and ancient humanity got wiped out by the foreigners, basically. Uh, when they were running from the flood, the foreigners thought they were invading their space, so they started killing them. But it turns out they were just running from the flood. Who are taking over their space. Pretty cool though. Thanks for the 10 bucks, dude. I appreciate it. Who's next? There it is. That's and he just popped up on the stream. Oh, hello. God, these honor guards, dude. They are. I want this exact design back in Infinite. Like, this exact, exact fucking design, one to one. Don't change a damn thing. I don't know what those seat things are that are like for some reason explosive. I've never understood those. I'm always curious. Favorite soundtrack is Halo 2 for sure.
I love Halo 2 soundtrack. Oh my god, that's strafe. <laughs> Thank you, Nathaniel. You Me too, dude. Do you think Elite will return? <laughs> Definitely. I mean, we already saw an Elite action figure from Infinite, so I uh, I would assume they're, they're in the game. I really well hope so. A Halo game without Elites is not a Halo game, if you ask me. Unless it's a flood horror game, but even then, you can still have them in the game somewhere. Correct, Gwen, you are in trouble. Easy. Do you think everything will see another Primordial? Uh, no, because the whole point of the Primordial was that he was, like, the last precursor. I mean, it was known to lie, but at the same time, there's no evidence out there that any other precursors have, exist. And he wasn't even like a proper precursor. He was like part, part, part flood, part grave mine, part precursor. So probably not. No. Uh, Anthony, hopefully classic, but I'm not holding my breath. I'm not going to hold my breath. Oh, stuck him right on his methane tank. Lovely. Hey, what? I just saved your ass. God damn it, Tobias Funke. I can't believe that's David Cross, dude. I had no idea. Oh, where's the marine? How's it going, you two? So <laughs> Did we... so good. We're approaching the main temple now. I think he may have been on that pad when I opened it. <laughs> oh no, he's there. The as I can get. What's he doing? Sort of barrier. We're trying to find Goodbye, a way Tobias. around it. I'll keep you posted. Goodbye. There's this really disgusting sword lunge you can do here all the way over to there. I'm not going to try it because I'll choke it every time, but it's still a sick sword lunge. Poor ranger. Okay, <laughs> move on now. Didn't even get to shoot a bullet. Am I going to do another another one of these uh, streams? Uh, probably, yeah. I want to do a Halo 2 Legendary one at some point. Give myself like four hours and see how far I can get without wanting to jump off a bridge. I might try and do it. Come on. Didn't they say you'd be able to adjust your weapon view models? Uh, I don't know if they said it would be in this update, but <laughs> unfortunately you definitely can't. Because I've had to put the crosshair on lowered. Otherwise, I'll show you what I mean. If you leave it on regular... Um... Where is it? Is it gameplay? Yeah, so if you stick it on centered, like look how much of the screen the view model takes up. It's really annoying, so I've had to leave it on lowered. The same issue that Reach had when it launched. That was a fucking miserable attempt at a sword lunge. As was that. No. Ugh. Best 
it's the largest Covenant fleet I've ever seen. The largest anyone's ever seen. Get inside the temple. Uh -oh. No regret before it can stop us. Do you know the precursors really look like? Uh, only if you like concept art and stuff. Or like fan art. There's a description in um. Oh god. In like I think it was Primordium. They're basically like formless. They can kind of take whatever form they want. Uh. Too many for me to track. Oh my god. Never been in it before. Huh. The more you know. Yeah, they're basically formless. They can sort of like take whatever form they want. Um. They are literally the ultimate being. Fuck. They are literally the ultimate being. Like, they can basically just do whatever the fuck they want. <laughs> Goodbye. Yeah, I really don't like the carbine sound in H2A. <laughs> Classic H2 is so much better. The Covenant team has <laughs> do whatever they want Wait, apart from exist, exactly. Too many for me to track. We don't have much time. Oh god. Come on, honor guard. There we go. There are honor guards all over Where's that fuel rod cannon? There used that? to be a fuel rod cannon down here. Is there still one? The there was- I'm pretty sure- oh, there it is. I knew there was. Oh, that's not worth it. Got fuck all ammo. Alright, come on, regret. Let's get this over and done with. How the hell is he there? <laughs> uh, it will be. I've got bad news for you, regret. There's the target. Take him out. I love how they're like human blood as well. They bleed like humans. Hang on, did any more honor guards even spawn? <laughs> oh yeah. Okay. Are turning around. The fleet is preparing to fire on our position. We need to get out of here. We need to get out of here. Uh, average bear. There's like a little rumor that the foreigners basically, or that the precursors basically let the foreigners kill them. Um. Out of like, they were just purely amazed that one of their creations could even do that. So they just let it happen. Michael Fino, thanks for the five bucks, dude. Might be a weird, a dumb question, but do the, do the Flood actually eat people? Um, I don't remember if they actually, like, I don't think they fully do. Um, they can bite you and affect you through a bite. I'm trying to remember if in, if in Mona Lisa they actually showed anyone being fully eaten. I don't think they did. It was just a bite. Um, no, I don't think they can. I don't think they do. Thanks for the five bucks, dude. I appreciate it. Oh yeah, Jarek. I need a weapon. Uh, basically, Dino Master, the penitent tangent, the uh, monitor of the Halo was like really, really neg negligent and let a flood outbreak happen. Was within our grasp. If you had not withdrawn our phantoms, are you questioning my decision? No, holy no, oracle. Holy I only wish to express my concern that the brutes... Recommissioning the guard was a radical step. But recent events Say that again. made it abundantly clear that the elites can no longer... Hey, Dave, welcome, dude. Safety. How's it going? I shall relay your decision to the council. Because it does legendary ostrich, it kills, like, any, like, any, any species with a nervous system. Do you know Data, thanks for two quid, dude. I would, I would love that. That would be sick. I'd be down for that, definitely. Of this 
Exchange that would be cool. We have always been your protector. Thanks for the two pounds, I appreciate it. Times for all of us. Even as the humans' annihilation filled us with satisfaction, the loss of one of the sacred rings racked our hearts with grief. Putting a poor guy, our sorrow. We renewed our faith in the prophecy that other rings would be found, and see how our faith has been. I need a weapon. He ain't Halo. wrong, even if he's lying. <laughs> Thank you, Jason. How long have I been alive? Uh, about three hours-ish now. For ages, we searched for one who might unlock the secrets of the ring. An oracle. And with your help, we found it. Indeed. With appropriate humility, we Thanks for the five bucks again, Michael Vida. I appreciate it, dude. Uh, yes, brutes do eat people. Um... Shown us they do. The key. They eat anything, pretty much. You journey to the surface of the ring and retrieve this sacred icon. With it, we shall fulfill our promise. Salvation for all. Salvation. I need a weapon. Journey. Once the shield is down, you will head straight to the library. I do not wish to keep the hierarchs waiting. The human that killed the prophet of regret. Who was it? Who was it? Who do you think? The demon is here? <laughs> Why? Looking for a little payback? Retrieving the icon is my only concern. <laughs> of course. Two works from Koto again. Thank you, dude. What's your favorite achievement? Uh, I don't think I really have a favorite achievement. Um, the most satisfying one I've ever got was probably... Uh, <laughs> Getting an overkill on Halo 3, actually. So maybe that. Brett Paulson, thanks for the membership, dude. I appreciate it. This is a cool section of a cutscene. I really hope Enforcers come back in infinite. I fucking love the Enforcers. Pick you up when you're finished. Who inspired you to make videos? No one really, just sort of started making them. Uh, thank you, dude. Thank you, Availing Access. I appreciate that, man. Mitchell Valentin. Thanks for the five bucks, dude. Will you play Infinite on Series X or PC and Y? Also, really love your content and keep up the hard work. Thank you, man. I appreciate that a lot. I really do. Um, PC, for sure, for me. Um, I don't play Xbox really anymore. Um, I'm going to get a Series X just because, like, I want to have one. But I, I don't really... I don't really play console anymore, so PC for me, definitely. Um, I love keyboard and mouse. I I struggle with... Um, well, not struggle. I sound like a fucking boomer when I say that, but I, I don't like I don't like controller um, anymore. Keyboard and mouse is what I feel extremely natural with, uh, and it's what I enjoy playing games with where possible. So for me, for sure, it's going to be PC. Definitely. Um, but yeah, thanks for the five bucks, dude. And here we have one of the most underrated missions of all time. Favorite phantom design is Halo 2. <laughs> Vibe to flood music, exactly. Alright, let's save these two. Stupid Jack, we'll see, thank you. Oh no! Oh, he survived, thank god. There's two of them. Jack will move. I'll be there, I'll save you. Hey, thanks, Brett. I appreciate it, dude. Mighty one. Hyping up the new hit with all my friends and throwing down some serious lore on them. <laughs> hey, nice. No better way to hype him up. Thanks a lot, man. I appreciate the membership. Gutless. Oh, is he not gonna not gonna save the line? What is it with sentinels and flying down into abysses in this port? He didn't see the line, unfortunately. You hate to see it. I'm getting close to one of the shields in the ring. Many of my brutes have fallen, attempting to take it down. Let's see if you fare better. Where is that something? There it is. Cozy with the two boats again. Give the jackal a BR. Can you even do that? I know you can give him a car by him, but I didn't. I've never seen one with a BR before. Thanks for the two bucks, dude. I need a weapon. Mm. 
Favorite Halo gun? Probably the Halo 2 battle rifle. Personally, I love it. Come on, Jackals. And Grunt. Come on, Grunt. Come on. There we go. <laughs> oh, there's another one. We've got a small militia forming now. Um, Zeta Halo, probably. Oh, favorite for a design. Oh, okay. Uh, Delta Halo. For me. Patrick Fanner with the two books. Thank you, dude. Opinion on Joe Statham's contribution to the story. The man is an absolute fucking wordsmith, and I admire him greatly. Um, Joe Staten writes Halo like nobody else. He is the Halo writer to me. Um, like, if I could pick one person to write Halo Infinite or to write a future Halo game, it would be Joe Staten. He just gets Halo more than anybody else. Um, obviously, <laughs> the man has more than got experience with it, uh, but Joe Staten to me is... Joe Staten is Halo. But you know what? I'm going to leave those Jackals and Grunt behind because they're going to die here anyway. You know what? Let's not cheese it. Let's actually kill the Enforcer. Oh, hang on. They're here. They actually followed us through. They're about to get annihilated by the Flood, but still. The Grunt didn't decide to come. The Grunt coward. Understandable. Yeah, Joe Staten is an absolute master of the word. I love this section. I love how vast the Sentinel Wall looks. You know what? I'm gonna give him a. Uh, I'm gonna give him plasma rifles. Okay, for some reason, that guy doesn't want one. <laughs> okay, but this guy's gonna have one. Enjoy. Do with it what you will. How big is the wall? Uh, I don't know the actual dimensions of it. It's just, <laughs> just very, very fucking big. <laughs> Pretty much. Blasted machine. Tartarus, you pussy. Stay here. Okay. Jackals. It's been nice knowing you. Jesus Christ. Oh, we have to do the entire bridge again, dude. Do I prefer weapon skins or none? Uh, yeah, weapon skins are a cool idea. As long as they're handled well and they're not like over the top or stupid. I'd love something like Dark Matter in Call of Duty for Halo. That'd be cool. What the fuck? Hello. Jekyll's already dropped their weapons on, the con on my console when at this point. Uh, that's not scripted, no. I'd... Mine have kept have kept theirs. They're about to be uh, yeeted, but they've kept them. Alright, let's kill the Enforcer, and then I am out of here. Sorry, Jekyll's. You're going to have to fend for yourselves. Jack Blow, thank you for the five bucks, dude. I just want to find out how the ring is powered still in, is still powered in infinite. You know what I mean? Even like the like Zeta Halo, how it's still powered, or how Halo rings in general are powered. Um, they're using fusion gel partly to power themselves. Um, at least some of the ring subsystems uh, use inf infusion gel. Halo Wars 2 told us that. Um, that's a power in general. I don't know actually. 
I know the rings do have like dedicated power generator like compounds and, and facilities. Maybe that's it. I need a weapon. Thank you for the five bucks, dude. I appreciate it. Oh shit. Oh, the I've just noticed the the effect on the sentinel beam is a bit fucked. It doesn't really look. It starts miles away from where the good ends. Yikes! You want to donate, but you can't. I don't know how anything. Uh. So man, I'm not sure. If, I'm not sure how to fix that. Um. I'm afraid I'm not sure. I appreciate the thought, though, man. I appreciate it. Thank you, Evading Access. Thank you, dude. Me too. Have I done a video on pre-insurrection UNSC? Uh, like 2300 UNSC, 2100. I'm not sure. I feel like I have done a, like a long time ago. I think. Oh, shit. Go away, carrier forms. I'm just gonna scoot on by the carrier forms. Oh, fuck. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus. Whew. You can save the Marines, can you? I didn't realize you could. Hang on, where are even all the Marines on this part? They're... I think they're in that first area, aren't they? Michael Fino with the five bucks again, dude. Thank you very much. I was talking to my brother about, about this the other day. Are the Flood and Sea aware of slash under control of the Grave Mine from 2 and 3? No, they're not. Uh, why they're not, <laughs> we don't really know. It's more like poetic license, but they, are, they aren't under control. They're just controlled by the um, proto-grave mind. This section right here is like peak flood horror. Dude, how many of them have got fucking shotguns? <laughs> they just give them all shotguns. Holy shit. Favorite Halo game is Halo 2. Oh my god, that was close. Halo 2. Then Halo C, then Halo 3. Yeah, exactly. They wouldn't they would not have needed a proto grave mind if they were under control of the grave mind on here. Oh fuck. There is something horse, please. Do what you're supposed to. I just, I didn't realize you could even knock symptoms out the sky. They are, they are not covenant. Oh, this, these humans, where even are they? I thought they were just coming in over the, over like a radio, like an intercom. I didn't realize they were actually, oh, those ones. Okay. How can you save them? So grab mine thick. A little bit. A little bit. Oh boy, another spammer that I already reported. Some fucking Twitch.tv in his name, moron. Oh, I love the fact that even though they've been reported, they can still spam. That's sick, YouTube. Well done. <laughs> would you do a video about what would have happened if Chief failed in Station 04? Um, I tried that video idea a while ago. I tried like a sort of what if scenario video, and I thought they would have done really well, but they did, like, both videos that, that I tried did really badly. So. Probably not. At least for now. At least for now. Uh, I tell you, I've seen him before. I've been subbed to him for years now. I used to watch his Reach videos back in the day. I'm pretty sure his videos actually helped me do Reach on Legendary.
Does your monitor have crosshairs? I found it a much more enjoyable experience playing it as I'm so used to red dot sights. What do you mean uh, by crosshairs? Do you mean for like doing lasso with blind on? Or, I mean, cause the game has crosshairs by default. Favorite AR design? Uh, CE. Quite easily, quite easily CE. No. Yeah, I'm pretty sure right now in Amberclad it is actually getting overwhelmed by the flood. That's a good point. Hopefully that door doesn't kill me. That flood sounds so weird. It's kind of cool, though. Right, fellas, do I risk it and do I give a... Oh, do... <laughs> do I risk it and give an elite rocket launcher? Oh, fucking hell. Okay. Whoops. <laughs> oh, my fucking... These stupid bots, dude. Or spammers. Legit, fuck off. How is YouTube... Like, I don't... I don't know how YouTube doesn't pick up on this by default. Kota, thanks for the- oh yeah, I read that one out already. Um, Legendary Ostrich. You can see the marines that say suppressive fire. Oh, okay. I, uh, I did not know you could see them. Oh my god. Oh god, let me- let me down, please. Are they gonna chase me? Oh god, they are. <laughs> I've never had a flood form chase me. Favorite melee weapon. I mean, there's only really two, isn't there? Sword, for me personally. Halo 2 sword. I love Halo 2 sword so much. Halo 2 sword, for me, is absolute pinnacle sword. In terms of like, how fast you can swing it, how far you can lunge, all the button glitches with it and stuff. I love it so much. Look at that. I've never noticed that before until General Heed's video. Seeing the Sentinel factory being brought down. I'm sorry, Elite. You might be dying down there, but we're watching this. How sick does that look? Seeing the Sentinel factory actually come down. And then, in the next mission, we actually go through it. Bet you never noticed that before. Unless you've seen General Heed's video, of course. Then you will have, then you will have seen it. Oh god. Yeah, how did how sick is that, right? Actually seeing it come down. I never noticed that before until he made a video a few weeks ago. And I was like, what the fuck, dude? Right, okay. Mr. Plasma Rifle, take it. This is a great risk, but <laughs> Oh god, okay. He's already firing it. He's he's a bit trigger happy. Right, let's go. Tough make for a place in the mausoleum. One Texas gamer, what's my opinion on pineapple, on pineapple and pizza? I absolutely love it. <laughs> I love pineapple and pizza. It's one of my like top five favorite toppings. Up there with pepperoni, jalapenos, beef, chicken, ham, tuna. Honestly, like I'm easy. I love anchovies on pizza as well. I'll eat anything on pizza. I fucking love pizza. Thank you, Connor. That's one happy elite. Yeah, it is indeed. Oh my god. He almost took me out then. Where's Arthas? Did Arthas not spawn? He's normally on that shade turret. Uh hello? There he is. Arbiter, what are you doing here? <laughs> oh, but just ignoring him. We must hold this camp until reinforcements. Stand firm. Oh my god, look at this absolute chad, dude. He said he's got a history with the flood. Hey, Green, how's it going, dude? Hey, fourth world, dude. Made Jackal's video, I will call Dave. I will make a Jackal video at some point. Some point. 
saw me through. It was faith that saw me through. Thanks for the two bucks, there, dude. I appreciate it. Hey, Paul, as well. Halo 2 graphics are new and why? Um, overall, I'm still going to say that I favor classic Halo 2 just because of, like, nostalgia. And some of the aesthetics in it are just better, I think. Like, I don't, I really don't like HB's Warthog. Um, what else is there? I don't like the Warthog. The sniper's cool, um, but very different. What else is there? That's about it, but I, I really don't like the Warthog. Other than that, though... HOA looks sick, but I just overall prefer Halo Halo 2. It's the sounds that get me. I really don't like how some of the shit sounds in H2A. Like I don't like how the um Oh what's that? Oh the carbine. I hate the carbine sound. Um Most of it's alright though. Did I like Halo 2 on launch? I absolutely loved Halo 2 on launch. I absolutely loved it. Is that it? There we go. Yeah, the new stuff's sick, don't get me wrong, but I love the classic. I love the classic stuff so much. Ugh. Now this is an iconic cutscene. In the center of this zone is a sacred icon critical to the great journey. I must find it. We shall cut into the heart of this infestation, retrieve the icon, and burn any flood that stands in our way. Uh. The parasite is not to be trifled with. I hope you know what you're doing. Uh, Johnny, maybe. I don't know. Getting back to Halo 3 height nowadays is hard. I honestly don't think... Uh, it's not impossible, but I think it's going to be very, very, very hard if it doesn't have some sort of one-life big Battle Royale type game mode. Like, not strictly Battle Royale. But something like it that, like, is very conducive to streaming and very conducive to getting, people, like, a lot of people into it. Like, I don't... Wow. Okay. <laughs> I don't... I don't know. I worry that regular Halo multiplayer can't cut it anymore. Because, like, content for games like it just isn't really there anymore. Not saying that Halo can't do it, but I don't know. We'll see. Mad Nubber, thanks for the £5, dude. In Halo Infinite, the Warthog looks like the one in Halo 2, but you like that one, right? Yeah, I love the Halo 2 one. Um, didn't like the Halo 2 Anniversary one. I mean, the one in... Um, no, the one in the original trailer was just the Halo 5 model, I think. I'm pretty sure it was a reused asset. It looked exactly the I same as Halo 5's. Go on, over the edge. Tearing through them like butter. Oh my god, hang on. Another fucking spammer. Guys, comment doesn't even make any sense. <laughs> hey, Michael Pino, thanks a lot, man. Huge fan of your versus videos. I've had this debate with my brother a few times. Do you think Master Chief could take on a Jedi? Oh, yeah, me and Eckhart have discussed this a little bit before. We might do this that as a video at some point. Um, honestly... Probably not. I mean, Jedi mind powers are, like, kind of overpowered. Don't shoot. Please don't shoot. Look at the foot. The barrel. No. Fucking hell, dude. Uh, Jedi mind powers are kind of overpowered, so I'd probably say no. Uh, there was no spammer in the chat because the, um, the auto mod in YouTube chat actually picked it up for once and blocked it, but I just banned them. Yeah, the force and mind powers... Just too much, if you ask me. I don't think Chief could do anything about that. Like, I mean, Chief got kind of fucked up by the Didact basically using Force Choke on him in, in Halo 4, so I don't think it would end particularly well. I'm on my way. But there's nothing from stopping a Jedi from just Force Choking him. Like, right off the bat. Right, give me the Scorpion. Oh, no, 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 no. Bungie giving the flood a scorpion was a bad, bad, bad idea. <laughs> Terrible idea. At least that's not a gorse hog. Unlike the one later on in the mission. Oh, you know what? We're dipping. 
Green, T-Vex, thank you. Ditch Bailey, I will work for free. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Thanks to T-Vex, dude. I appreciate it. I always love thinking that that pelican right there. Fucking hell. What the hell was that? That was the pelican firing his missiles at me. Right. We're skipping this entire section. Fucking checkpoints. I always like thinking that that pelican over there um, I'm on my way. is like Jonathan and Miranda. Go into the icon. I did not realize they actually fired missiles in this game. You learn something new every day. Okay, it didn't fire this time. The scorpion fired? Holy shit. Wow. You really do learn something new every day. No. Put that for a barrel roll. Pelican trick charge, pretty much, yeah. Ooh, I wouldn't mind going through this section in a wraith. Get that parasite out of it, Arbiter. There we go. I love the Halo 2 wraith so much. I might be dead here. Oh my god, another Enforcer. There we go. Probably gonna get boarded when these... I need a weapon. ...things come around. <laughs> it's Mission 2020. Spilling Cokes, thanks for two bucks again, dude. I appreciate it. You're making work from home very bearable. Great to hear, man. That's great to hear. That's very good to hear. I hope everything's going well for you. Oh, shit. Oh, no. No enforcer, please. There we go. I'm not sure if you can get a wraith up here. Oh, it's over there, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, rocket flood kind of... Shit. Oh, god damn it, dude. Oh. Right, I swear to god, the, the, the checkpoints were not this bad in original Halo 2. I, I'm adamant they weren't. Oh, please don't hit me with missiles. Yes, thank god. I might be misremembering, but I'm almost certain they weren't this bad. Good evening, Stinky Goober Gamer. <laughs> That's quite a name. Right, you know what? Fuck this section, we're skipping it. I love Halo 2's Ghost. I'll take back what I said earlier. Halo 2's Ghost is my favourite. Not Halo 3's. Fucking hell, dude. Maybe not. <laughs> no! Oh my god, if we survive this. We've got a bloody scorpion to deal with around this corner as well. I love just listening to Steve Vai go crazy in the background. Yeah, true, actually. You do have to... Yeah, that's a good point. Uh, devil. That is a good point. Oh, yes. Jack, I agree. Wholeheartedly. I fucking love that sound effect. And, like, the, the whole firing effect in general from Halo 2 was so satisfying. Or the whole explosion, exploding effect. So satisfying. Ooh. God damn, how many sentinels? I know we're in a sentinel factory, but Christ almighty. And that was a bad time for a stutter game. That was not a good time to stutter. <laughs> hey, spilling coats again. Thank you, dude. Can John get drunk or is his metabolism too high? Oh. Uh, it's actually a very good question. I'm not sure. I never thought about that. I'm, I mean, I would assume that he could. It would be a lot harder than a regular person, but I reckon he probably could, you know. So, I mean, he's like peak physical fitness, so his body, his body could probably metabolize all the alcohol 
quite quick, but at the same time, you you can get anyone drunk if you <laughs> give them enough alcohol. Oh, I'd love to stay and fight, Enforcer, but I have no ammo at all. Oh shit, where do they come from? I'll take that sword. Thank you very much. No. Oh, I was hoping to go for a full on launch then. Not like that. Really? Why do I like the battle rifle? It's fun to use, takes skill, has a very nice sound effect, looks sick. Uh, Mythic, in terms of campaign, classic just. In terms of multiplayer, classic by a long shot. I really, I, I genuinely prefer Halo 5 multiplayer over Halo 2 Anniversary multiplayer. For some reason, I just really, really don't like h 2 multiplayer at all. Um, I'm really not a fan. No, don't run into me. Please don't run into me. Oh, God. Thank you. How much would Chief need to eat to keep his energy up? Well, in a... Oh, hang on. In the flood, he literally stops halfway through the library, sits on one of the plasma banks, and eats a protein bar, so not too much. Obviously, like, with doing what he's doing, he's going to need more energy than your average human. His calorie intake is going to have to be a lot higher. Um, but... I think he can get away with, like, a protein bar or something. I mean, he can get away with a protein bar. Uh, Halo 1, personally, Connor. Halo 1 for me, personally. I prefer- I just prefer it. Oh, really? Oh, fuck's here. Oh, God. Oh, please, no more flood. Ooh. Right, i tell you what. Try and take that wraith out early. And I'm going to get that scorpion. Right, you can get out of that. I'm actually going to take the scorpion now. The magical bar of life. Am I going to play Doom Eternal soon? I have finished Doom Eternal. Um, only once, actually. I am going to stream it again on Twitch, though, at some point soon. I want to try an Ultra Nightmare run. Uh, so make sure you follow the Twitch if you want to watch that. Hey, Green, thanks for the five bucks, man. I appreciate it. Be like a, me ascending nutcase. Embrace Bionicles and become a turbo vision today. Let me inform you of the deeper themes of Bionicle lore. Dude, I used to be fucking, like, hardcore into Bionicle and the lore. I used to read all the books, watch all the movies, uh, go on, like, all the websites they used to build. I used to be fully into it. Rest in peace, my sweet, sweet Bionicles. I need a weapon. I need a weapon. Hello, Artas. Wait, is that Artas? Yeah, it is. Hero Factory, yeah, that was like the fake Bionicle that came back. I bought like one or two of those and they weren't awful, but it just, it just wasn't Bionicle, dude. Bring back Bionicle. Oh, that was close. Vanguard, and I think I have done. I think someone linked me that not too long ago. Stick it in the Discord, bro, and have a look, I'll have a look after this. Bionicles were indeed the ship. I agree, Sonic. You see them kind of cute. They are cute in their own, in their own special way. God, the Scorpion looks so good in H2A. I love the design for it. The sound's sick as well. I prefer the original sound. But, I don't know. Actually, I don't prefer it or not prefer it. I like them both equally. Take that back. What the fuck? Is that another Scorpion? Somewhere. I definitely just got hit by another Scorpion. Oh yeah, it's over there. I did not know there was another Scorpion here. 
You really do learn something new every day. I love how sparkly everything is this. Everything is in this area. Keith David's voice is buttery as shit, in it? Keith David's voice is... Ooh. Perfect, dude. Oh, shit. I really wish the Arbiter got more screen time in Halo, in Halo 5. That would have made the game, like, partially bearable for me. If he was more of an important character. Because he, he was kind of just shoe, shoehorned in there for fan service, I think. Like, you, the sad thing is, like, his arc in Halo 5 was the best arc, and yet you could cut it from the game, and the game would still, like, like function, ex or the story would function almost exactly the same. Spinning coach, thanks for the five bucks, man. What do you think is stronger, Mark 6 Mjolnir or an Iron Man suit? Probably Mjolnir. I don't know too much about, um, the Iron Man suit. It's, like, the lore behind them. But I do... I do prefer massively uh, Mark VI, so I'm a bit biased there, but I think it would be better. Yeah, I saw that, Emmy. I saw that. It's kind of a joke. He's in a lot of stuff. He's a, he's a busy guy, Keith David is. I love this cutscene as well. There's something about this cutscene that I, I, it's short and sweet, but I love it. It's like pure desperation. More humans. <laughs> we must be after the icon. On your way, Arbiter. I'll deal with these beasts. Bring Arthas back, dude. Please. Please, P43. Bring him back. I beg of you. Bring him back. Fuck you, Tartarus. I call him a coward. The one sat in a phantom flying above me. Nice and safe in his phantom is the one calling Artas a coward for going to fight the flood. Bring Artas back indeed. I honestly Vanguardian same. I would be Honestly, of all the characters to put into the game, he would be on par with Mendic and Bias for me. If they brought him back. Enemy of our lord. Enemy of our lord. Very underrated indeed. Easily in my top five characters. Hey, Microfino, thanks, dude. In that cutscene, Arthas' sword, classic... I, I'm sorry, that again. Arthas' uh, sword is classic round design as well. Yeah, it is. It's like the Halo 2 design. Not the weird, like, Halo 4, H2. That's another thing, actually. That reminds me. Thank you for saying that. One of the other things that I don't like about H2A is the sword design. Uh, I don't like how the sword looks in Halo 3 onwards. Halo 2's was, like, pinnacle for me. I love Halo 2's sword so much with how round it is. Um... And like, it, I don't know, it just looks better. Sick. <laughs> right, you can take that because needlers are... Why can't I... There's some AI you can't swap weapons with for some reason, like that jackal earlier. That one jackal that just wouldn't take my plasma rifle. I need a weapon. Right, I'm going to stop jumping. <laughs> that is a good point, Emmy. Although, uh, not... Was he, though? Was he talking to Mendicon Bias? He could have been. I don't know if he was. I mean, I don't know if he was for sure. It's not like in uh, Halo 2 where it's confirmed that Mendicon is the one Cortana's having that little AI war with. Uh, but the idea that he had some sort of interaction with him is quite cool. That would be like... Perfect to explore in a Halo 3 anniversary terminal. Go 
come back. Mendicant is your favorite villain. Yep, he is indeed. Mendicant is my favorite villain because he's not just like a two-dimensional bad villain. Like, he's like the most fucking ten-dimensional character in Halo. Along with the Arbiter. Oh, through the floor. Lovely. Did I kill that? I didn't kill it. Oh, hit him either. What the fuck? I just like, missed them both. Sword really is the best for this. How do you in the Halo 1 and Halo 2 change between Anniversary and Classic? Uh, on PC, you press Shift. Uh, press Tab, sorry. On console, I believe you press Back. I think it is. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's Back on console. Oh, yeah. I love how you can fly around with a sword in this game. It's easily the most fun sword to use. Not even close, dude. No other sword comes close to this. Oh, lovely. Clinical work. Thanks to the two Michael, again, dude. Have you ever seen Red vs. Blue? Uh, yes, I have done. I watched uh, way back in like 2003, 2004 on like fucking Google videos before YouTube was even a thing. I watched like what, like a lot, quite a few episodes when I was really young. I need a weapon. Probably not in the right order. I just sort of watched them because it was like funny Halo video, pretty much. <laughs> and I was like very young at the time and I was looking for that stuff all the time. Um, I've not watched it recently, but I know that the animation for the season that's coming out next looks really fucking good. Oh, we're here. You know what? Before we go, we're actually going to get the toy. Oh, see, that makes me sad because I guarantee these elites are dead as soon as Arbiter gets yeeted down the fucking the pit to the grave mine. Those two elites are probably dead. And by probably, I mean they're, they're definitely going to be dead. Oh, fucking hell. Going to reach his story and he's living Halo. He's the PS4 guy. Hey, nice dude. Great to hear. More Halo fans, the better. Oh, dude. I have one more need to get this goddamn toy. Right, okay. There we go. Oh, shit on it. Are we there already? Oh god, it's still moving. Oh my god. <laughs> How long did it take you to finish Halo 2 on Legendary? Um, I can't remember. The last time I did it, like, all the way through was when MCC first came out. So six years ago. Fucking hell, six years ago, dude. Um, so I can't remember exactly how long it took me. Uh, a while, I remember. Even longer on co-op. Because obviously the Iron Skull is on by default in co-op. Bungie thought that CE was too easy. <laughs> Very strange decision, but, you know. How far away? Oh my god, that put us really far back. Shit. Sorry, Elite. What the? F I don't even know what just happened. <laughs> you want to experience Halo 2 on Legendary? I mean, it's worth doing. It's hell, but it's worth doing. If I stand here, will that block all the spawns? Or 
are literally gonna spawn elsewhere. Let's see. He crossed him up your ass with a shot, you pretty much. Yeah, he got a bull tree. Yeah, you can, Chris. Can you switch between the, uh, the, uh, the drop of a finger? <laughs> drop of a finger on, on tab. I'm gonna save that one frag. Oh, almost. Almost got him. No! Oh my god, he was mid swinged and that would have killed me. One of the best things about the sword and hitter too is how well it like fits the flood gameplay. Like you can just keep swinging and swinging and swinging as much as you want. As fast as you want as well. Behold the library of our lords. Never heard that before either. The library of our lords. Right, let's get that goddamn toy. <laughs> yeah, Halo 2's Flood is definitely the worst iteration to fight. The sword just makes it more bearable, in my opinion. I prefer Halo CEs myself. Oh my god, they're still spawning Flood. Okay, we're at the library now. Behold the library of our lords. Uh, yes, Evan, I am using keyboard and mouse. I love this area so much. It looks so fucking aesthetic. Did I have a beat Halo 2 lasso? No, I didn't even get past the first, first mission of Halo 3 lasso. Let alone Halo 2. Arbiter, go and get the, the Didact toy, which I think it, it is on here. Sorry, Elite. Okay. Oh, just. Is it the Didact one? Yeah, it is. There we go. Um, probably not Noah, because there weren't really many that came out that really piqued my interest. I didn't, I didn't want to make a video about something that I wasn't particularly, like, interested in. Um, if any good ones come out, then I will do for sure. But, we'll see. Oh, this is a good fight scene. We've just finished Quarantine Zone, uh, Ben. Something really satisfying about the way the the icon holder opens up. Uh, I'm not knee soft because if you play with um with centered, it makes the view model really weird. Your father never asked me for help either. The index is secure. Spicy Parmesan, thanks for the two bucks, dude. Two years of updates for infinite or new game in three years. Um, how's our exit? It all depends on how infinite is at launch, if you ask me. And whether or not my opinion on that will change or be based upon whether or not I like the game at launch. If I don't like the game, then I want a new one. If not, then I want it to be constantly updated. Oh, <laughs> oh you <How> doing? <laughs> Johnson is such a fucking chad, dude. The SMG sound is so beefy there as well. I love how it sounds. Excellent work, Arbiter. The Hierarch will be pleased. The icon is my responsibility. It was. What's your responsibility? Now it is mine. 
A bloody fate awaits you and the rest of your incompetent race. And I, Tartarus, chieftain of the brutes, will send you to it. And the prophets learn of this. But they will take your head when, when? they learn. <laughs> Fool. They, they ordered, ordered me to, to do it. it. Pog. Since you're on PC watching monitor setup, I have two monitors and a 4K TV. Um, 4K TV that I use as both a TV and also a monitor, and then two monitors that I just I use as, as monitors. <laughs> At this moment, the Covenant lost the war. Yeah, pretty much. This is on normal Carter. There he is. Vegas, I wouldn't get past the first encounter on Cairo Station. Honestly, bro, it would be hell to watch. Relax. Hey, Jake, how's it going, dude? This thing off. Not bad. How you doing? This one is machine and nerve. And has its mind concluded. This one is but flesh this and one faith. This is but flesh and faith. And is the more deluded. Matthias Prune, thanks for the five bucks, dude. Parasite. You ever feel like crashing vehicles into a more clunky than see? Not really, no. Uh, I don't know, not particularly. In terms of combat, they're better here, but I think I prefer the feel and I need a weapon. Yeah, I, I can understand that. It's definitely like a specific feeling that no other Halo game has. Come out, come out of all those vehicles is certainly something. Thanks for the five bucks, dude. I appreciate it. I kind of agree, kind of don't. Sort of. I see where you're coming from, though. I am the prophet of regret. Council of the... I... 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 of the Covenant. Here? At last, we have much to do. This facility must be activated if we are to control this outbreak. Bit late for that. Where you are, nothing can be done until my sermon is complete. Not true. <laughs> this installation has a successful utilization record of 1.2 trillion simulated in one actual. It is ready to fire on demand. On demand. All the objects our Lord left behind. There are none so worthless as these oracles. How do you think the flood returning in ATN is going to impact Infinite? Probably not at all. It was a very contained story. Uh, probably not at all, unfortunately. We'll see you though. You never know. Could have done without seeing this scene in HD. Your prophets have promised you freedom from a doomed existence. But you will find no salvation on this ring. Those who built this Lethal land, thanks for the two bucks, dude. A great journey was an inside job. <laughs> I mean, it kind of was, you know. Truth knew it was all bullshit, so. As they did before. This thing is right. Halo is a weapon. Your prophets are making a big mistake. Your ignorance already destroyed one of the sacred rings, demon. It shall, shall not, not harm another. If you will not hear the truth, then I will show it to you. There is still time to stop the key from turning. But, but first, first it must, must be found. You will search one likely spot. And you will search another. Same Dorian. I I like to think the same thing as well. But this ring will make us I mean, we know for sure that the the primordial sort of consciousness exists still. Like the the consciousness of all the grave minds is sort of like pulled together. It's one existing thing. So like that grave mind had the same consciousness as like all the grave minds, um, in the like the Fauna Flood War and all the other ones as well. One of the best voice actor teams. I I agree, Cameron. D. Bradley Baker absolutely killed it as a grave mind. Was unexpected, unfortunate, but there is no need to panic. Truth, what was his goal? Just control and power, really. A moment that all the Michael, thanks for the five bucks, dude. If the footer in infinite, how would you like to see them come back? Any ideas for new features? I'd like to see them come back, like completely out of it, like just a complete out of the blue moment. Um, and then any new features? 
Not even the blood can stop it. More forms. Uh, have them pilot vehicles, but have them like overtake, like con like consume vehicles, like in Halo Wars 2. That was really cool. But they start growing biomass on them. Um, the demon. Lean a bit more into the precursor roots. Have have the grave mind maybe t maybe mention something about the primordial or the precursors or like the the fauna flood war. I mean, he does anyway in this, but have him talk about that a bit more. Uh, that'd be really cool. Um, I'd like to see the UNSC develop some like purposefully anti anti flood weaponry like weaponry that is designed with for no other reason but to counter the flood flood riders <laughs> i'd like to see some for some human ais get infected with the logic pig as well that'd be cool I can neither confirm nor deny kevin oh shit i fucked up the checkpoint skip Hey, ostrich, thanks, dude. Thanks for the two bucks. Would you rather be infected by the flood or be composed? Probably composed, honestly. So at least then I'm kind of dead. Or at least then my body's not suffering pain anymore. Whereas if being in, in a combat form, it, it definitely would be. Little I need a weapon. First. So there's something else alive somewhere. Yo yo. Got him. Put me down on one of the pedestals near the door. Right. Do I think they'll ever cure the flood? Probably not, no. That prophet, truth, he has the index. You've got to take it from him. Do I though? Let me get these doors. What if I just left now, went back home? Go. It'll be easier to track. <laughs> just let him do what he wants to do. In the right, ready for the longest mission. Demon. Demon. Crikey me. Those grinners are peeling me. Fucking hell. <laughs> I did Dark Lord, Lord Ainsley. I think people were jumping the gun a little bit, honestly. Like, I agree with pretty much everything X said in that video. Right this way. I think BR would be great for Halo as long as it doesn't replace any existing mainline feature. As long as it was like Warzone and it was like added alongside everything else. I think BR would be astronomical for the growth of Halo personally. I've thought about making my own video about it, but I just know that it would get disliked as shit, so it's probably not worth it. Yeah. Yeah. Try for a flick shot. Watch out for the captain. It's got a brute shot. Oh wow, what a menacing foe. <laughs> I say that, I'm going to get destroyed by them in a minute. Where's the brute shot? There we go. There's nothing as satisfying as meleeing with the brute shot in Hitler 2. My god. Uh, Ostrich, I think it's like half and half. I love how it looks in both, honestly. I love the more weathered look in classic Halo 2, but I also love the really pristine, shiny look in uh, H2A. It does make sense that it would be more pristine because these are like the Prophets. The, the, the higher uh, areas of the city as opposed to the lower districts, but I don't know. I love how it looks in both. Michael Fino, thanks for the two bucks, dude. Marvel or DC? Um, honestly, probably DC, because Batman, like, Nolan's Batman trilogy is my favorite superhero thing of all time, ever. Um, and obviously, that's DC, so I'd probably say DC. Marvel's good as well. I'm not that into superhero stuff personally. Um, nowhere near as much as many people. Uh, I'm looking forward to Robert Pattinson's Batman a lot. Um, yeah. Other than that, I'm, I'm just like a massive Nolan Trilogy fanboy. 
That was like peak, peak, peak superhero stuff for me. Yeah, what? Nolan Trilogy is just, like, perfect. Honestly, would not change a single thing about any of those movies. None of them at all. I am personally more of a fan of uh, Rises as opposed to Dark Knight. I just, I fucking love Tom Hardy's Bane so much. Oh, shit. I love Tom Hardy's Bane so much. Spinning Cokes, thanks for the T-Bucks again, dude. What is the most wrong way to pronounce Mjolnir? Majolina. Me Me Major 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 <laughs> Oh fuck. In all fairness, I used to when I was a kid, I used to pronounce it Majolnir as well. I think I feel like, I feel like most people did. To be fair. I need a weapon. Uh <laughs> yeah, thanks to the T-Buck dude. Jaden Abraham, thanks for the four quid, man. I appreciate it. Uh Flood Firefight, yes or no? Absolute 100 percent massive yes. Uh Terminus Firefight in Halo Wars 2 with a flood is my favourite firefight mode. In. Um like better than ODST, Reach, everything else, and I love it. Um, I'd love to see something like that in a regular game. Thanks for the four pounds, dude. They need to take out the Storm Rifle. Plasma Rifles, I agree wholeheartedly. Storm Rifle is a very boring weapon, in my opinion. Um, in everything, in its design, its use case, like, they didn't even try and change it. It's just a Plasma Rifle that looks less interesting. Looks and sounds less interesting. I really don't know why they got rid of the Plasma Rifle in, in, in place of that. It, <laughs> It really doesn't compute for me. It's a boring looking weapon that's just a less interesting and less cool plasma rifle. Have I seen Nick Eli? I have indeed. I used to watch Nick Eli all the time. Before that shit that he went through with Microsoft that kind of Killed his channel, which really does suck. Oh uh, yeah, down we go. Come to the middle level. Oh no, okay. The Marines are just inside. Be careful of the guard. Yeah, the plasma rifle did look so alien. It just looked cool as fuck in general, in my opinion. I just love the <laughs> You fucking idiot. <laughs> I just love the design of the plasma weapon in general. It's my favourite looking covenant weapon by a long shot. Like top two, top three favourite Halo weapons of all time. Oh shit. What am I doing? What am I, I'm trying to melee. Michael, thanks for the five bucks, dude. I'm pronouncing things wrong. I hate how some of the Halo audiobooks they pronounce heard like H U D. Oh god. I've never heard that before, any of them that I've listened to. Which audiobook was that? That's yeah, that's kind of annoying. It just is HUD. Hey, thanks, Matt. I appreciate it, dude. My pleasure. Thank you for watching, man. I really do appreciate it. Your support means the world to me, so... The least I can do is answer a question. Thanks a lot, man. Absolutely staying safe. You too, man. You too. I appreciate it. Oh! Ugh. Go on. Off you go. Oh, fuck. Uh... Okay. Good. Get ready. How did the flood outbreak in Halo Wars 1? We don't actually know still. I don't think we know at least. I might have missed something, but I'm pretty sure we don't know. It just sort of happened. I might have been forget I might be forgetting some like obscure lore or something, but I, as far as I'm aware, we don't know how it happened. Unfortunately. Okay, your videos keep me from keep me up from night to day. <laughs> Thanks, Steve. I appreciate it. Michael, five again. Thank you, man. I appreciate this a lot. It was full of reach. They also pronounced me all near Majol. Oh, no. Oh, God, no. That's bad. I've never listened to the full of reach audiobook, so I, I wouldn't. <laughs> Thankfully, I've never heard that, but that's bad. Pronouncing it H U D, I can sort of understand, but calling it Maj Majolne is just wrong. Like, flat out wrong. <laughs> 
That isn't how it's pronounced in Norse mythology at all. Down the lift. <laughs> well done, Grunt. That is a high IQ play right there. Just drop to your death. Poor Jackals. When is new video coming out, Xperia? Um. Either Saturday or Sunday, it depends. It's a long one, so it depends how long it takes to make. Um, but it's going to be a good one. It's one that, I mean, fuck it. You guys want to hear what it is? I may as well say. It's not like I'm spoiling a goddamn movie trailer or something. <laughs> I may as well just say. Uh, let me know if you want to hear what it is in the, video, in the comments. Uh, Mastermind. Welcome, dude. Mastermind Evan. Welcome to the stream, dude. Fear not, my brother. Just melee this friend. Poor guy. Oh shit, this is a bad idea. Yeah, that was always coming. Uh, okay, yeah, you all want to know. <laughs> I'm not surprised. Uh, the video is the lore behind all the Halo 2 maps. All, and brace yourself, all 35 of them. I've finished writing the script for like 20 of the maps and it's like over 3,000 words long so far. So this is going to probably end up being my longest video yet. <laughs> I've been saying that a lot recently, but every time it's been true. Hopefully you guys like the longer videos. Uh, they're good to make and also they feed the YouTube algorithm really well. Um, more watch time is always a good thing for YouTube's algorithm. So it's like a win-win. Should be a good video. And this time, there is actually like like hard law. It's not like speculation like last time. It's like actual hard law this time. Not speculation like the CE map video. What's my favorite law? Blood stuff, definitely. And foreigner stuff. I need me a new sword. Well done, Marines. You actually survived. The elites have failed to protect the prophets. And in so doing, the world is at risk. For some reason, this hunter the encounter always takes me fucking them. ages. Now and then, you keep us safe whilst you find your time. God, they eat so hard with carbines. Got him. With my blessing, the brutes now lead our fleets. They ask for your allegiance, and you shall give it. And you shall give it. I always hate killing the elites first, but I need a sword, so <laughs> sorry. But it's got to be done. Watch this jackal scramble as soon as like nade lands in there. Oh, what? It fell through the floor, dude. These plants look so weird. They're like flood plants. They're like some of the plants from Guilty Spark in CE. Right, come on, turn around. Oh shit. Ooh, crikey me. Sentient Scythe, thank you for the 20, uh, for the five bucks New Zealand dollars. Thank you, dude. Uh, I wonder how this Six engine will compare to Unreal Engine 5 that just got had a showcase. Yeah, same as well. Unreal 5 looks sick. I mean, people are going crazy about how good it looks uh, in gameplay and what we saw was not gameplay, but it still looks really nice. So hopefully it looks not far off, off that. I'm not expecting it to look quite as good, but I wouldn't be surprised if it looks almost as good. Hopefully it does. I need a weapon. Thank you for the follow, there, dude. I appreciate it. Ch 
Chief may have accidentally released a flood. Uh, I mean, it wasn't. It was the Covenant confirmed. Like they they did it. Creatures of the Covenant. Oh my God, that guy is. This elite is thirsty, dude. I would love to as well, Daniel. I agree. We need a, a, a Halo 3 anniversary with more terminals talking to Mendicant. Uh, lol, Kyber, I am on normal. What are you doing? Fucking hell. Okay, hang on. <laughs> the British guy. I was incredibly hyped. I was actually talking to Actman not long after he released that video. Um, also, no, before he released it, he was saying, like, yeah, he, he mentioned to you and it refers to you as the British guy. I was like, holy shit, dude. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. My, uh, the video that me and Marty are going to be making together is going to be good. I think I am just going to do a regular interview with him, a bit like Actman did, but with, like, different questions and stuff. Because um, I, I don't really know what else I could do with him. I'd like to play through a campaign mission or two with him, but because he's West Coast America and I'm in the UK, it would, it literally, the footage would be awful. It would be unplayable because of, because of the connection. So unfortunately, I won't be able to do that as much as I'd love to. That would have been great, but yeah. Yeah, I'm going to, I'm going to post something or mention something in a video soon asking for questions from you guys. At this moment, the council is gathered on here to see the icon Uh, I hope not, Miguel. It doesn't sound so... It doesn't sound like it will be so far. It sounds very good so far. But then again, we've only heard, like, two tracks, so... You never know. Karim. Papa Pooey. <laughs> Take it somebody else watches fucking two mad streams. I'm not the only one. I have listened to the oracle, and it confirmed our deepest hope. The <gasps> great journey begins to fade. I mean, you knew that already, right? Hello, you come out of nowhere. Goodbye. Playing as the Elite or Banished with the Ood. <laughs> Probably uh, Elite or Banished. Love your content. Thank you very much, Atty Matter. Have a good night, dude. Thanks for stopping by. Daniel, I would fucking absolutely love to do that. If I could get that arranged, fuck me, I would love to do that. I might actually... You know what? Actually... Hold that thought. I might see what I can do. I mean, I don't know Joe State, and I've never met him or spoken to him before. Um, but man, I would, I would love, I would absolutely love to speak to him and make a video with him. Spinning coast. Thank you. Thanks for the two bucks, dude. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate it. Hopefully, I can help you whilst you're working from home. I would absolutely fucking love to make a video with Joe Staten. Him and Marty are like absolute just dream people to make a video with. Him and, and, and also Marcus Leto as well. Uh, I'd love to do a video with Marcus Leto as well. I want to actually want to speak to Marcus and see if I can do something like that. Because obviously this integration is coming out soon so we can talk about that. We can talk about Halo CE, Halo 2, 3, Reach, disintegration, uh, a bit about Destiny as well. That could be good. Ideally, I'd like to interview like all the major figureheads at Old Bungie. Just have a, like an hour-long video with all of them, including um, Jason Jones. That would be impossible because Jason Jones has been known, <laughs> like forever, not to do interviews. Um, he never used to do them back in the day, and he doesn't do them now. Oh god! Oh shit! Oh, good lord, that was close.
I was gonna say let me know if you guys want to see that like those those videos in the comments, but I mean I, Do I really need to ask that? <laughs> I don't think I need to ask that do I? I think the answer to that is a solid yes Patrick, uh, we don't know for sure. We know that he had, I think he had some say in it. I don't know for a hundred percent sure. Um, but obviously all the the ins and outs of what happened there, nobody will ever. I don't think any like people outside of those deals will ever know. Um, but I don't know. I'd like to think not, but I'm pretty sure he did. Lies, Harrison. Pretty much. Oh, Major. I love the Majors in Halo 2. No. Okay, he didn't one-shot me. Maybe it's only the Majors in the book that can one-shot with melee. There's a few rod around there anywhere. I would love another few rod or a beam rifle. Oh, lovely. Lovely. I do feel kind of bad killing the hunters here, knowing the ally with us on the next mission, but... Oh, well. It's necessary blood to be spilt. We have a video on Dimkey. Maybe in the future at some point. Maybe I do, like, Dimkey and Stolt. All in one video. Oh, I'm getting... Last time I played this mission, last stream, the stream got taken down for copyright strikes, but I'm pretty sure it was a false claim. But it was for Breaking Benjamin. Fuck it. I'll just have to keep talking quite quite constantly over Breaking Benjamin, even though the music is very iconic and you want to hear it. I would rather not get a copyright strike. But at the same time, I do kind of want to hear it. So, uh, just have to keep talking. Another very easy hunter encounter. <laughs> I fucking love throw me away in this section, dude. It fits so well. Oh. There we go. Oh, they already killed one of the uh, spec ops. Another one? Fuck you, drone. I'm pretty sure on the elevators here somewhere. There's that little elevators or grav lifts or something. Fuck. Oh, yeah. Here we go. I never knew they were here till H2A. And there goes the last shot of that. Oh, blow me away, it's so perfect here. It fits so well. Breaking the Covenant is sick as well, but I don't know, man. Blow me away. So good. Uh, Miguel, it's not the audio apart from like one soundtrack piece that I've heard has been mostly fine, actually. It doesn't seem as bad as Reach or notably CE. Um, but I'm not, I'm not sure. I might have just missed it. Ooh, crikey me. Oh, shit. Ah, it's the, fuck. The spec ops on a guard. I love what, the way they look. They're so cool. b Productions. Prediction. Thanks for two bucks, dude. Video is always solid to keep up the great work. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate it. Right, here we go. Got him. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Uh, Connor, I don't hate it, but I don't like it. Um, I need a it's weapon. not a faithful remaster like this is. And there we go. Do I play Warzone? I'm a go if you mean the ha the, the Halo 5 one. No, if you mean the um, Modern Warfare one. Yes, I play a lot of... Oh, okay. Yeah, those textures are fucked. <laughs> um, I play a lot. Uh... I uh, play a lot of Warzone, a lot of more for Warzone. I love it. Destiny 2 versus Halo 5. The Destiny 2. All the me. Rest on your shoulders, Chieftain. Favorite Halo mission? Uh, the one we're about to play, Mr. Username. Squash. Michael, thanks for the five bucks, dude. Yeah, yeah, same offer as last time. I'll give you 50 bucks to restart the level. 
<laughs> no chance, bro. I ain't doing that. I had no chance. Indeed. No chance. The great journey waits Appreciate the alpha, but nah. Not even you. What Halo book do I recommend the most? Uh, the four in a trilogy is very good. Welcome back, Chris. <laughs> Truth is so PM, he really is. I need a weapon. I need a weapon. And here we go. My favorite Halo mission of all time. You see the Marty interview? I did miss the Reclaimer. And uh, Marty reached out to, m to me after that interview. And he wants to do with one with me as well. So we'll be doing one on my channel soon too. Edanakis, thanks for the two bucks, dude. Mendic and Bias needs to be an infinite. I I agree. Fingers crossed. Do I not speak Spanish? I, uh, I speak very surface level Spanish. I can say a very few things. Favorite Halo C elite voice line. Uh let me think. Oh, move him up. That one. But I always think we're saying move him up. He's speaking. No. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was never sure if that, that elite was meant to be speaking in live or not. I assume they just didn't get time for like scripting his or like animating his mandibles, but you never know. Two New Zealand dollars from 17 South again. Thank you, dude. Ancient humanity ancient humanity law slash flood link. What do you mean? You mean links in the, the videos that I've made about it, the more links like between the two. Please don't finish me off. Oh, there we go. I love this campaign. This is my favorite mission of all time. Easily. Oh shit. Uh, a difficult level, as you can see, is normal. Cod Sinnott, you've typed that message about 30,000 times now. Uh, yeah, that's that's definitely I getting the point across, bro. Because <laughs> I play Warzone and I'm a sinner for sure, dude. Crowflow, thanks for two bucks, dude. Perhaps an old school on podcast about Halo on PC. I've been saying this for a little while now, but just watch this space. Uh, me, me and Axe have spoken about all schools on. We both want to do it again. Um... We're gonna try and get something going soon. I'm not sure what or where, but we're gonna. We want to do something. Um, we want to do something for sure. No brute weapons. Ooh, that might actually be a good idea. You know? I love using the brute shot in Halo 2, but that might not be a bad idea. Goodbye. Yeah, you know what? Fuck it. No brute weapons. We're doing it. Not using those dirty, dirty brute weapons. All right, in a bit, Ryan. Thanks for stopping by, bro. Uh, I do, Kevin. Absolutely. Oh, there we go. By the prophets. What have these books done? We had shed our brother's blood, and, and for that, they must, must die. die. Oh, Zealot. So much for a stealthy advance. Zealot. So much for a stealthy advance. Oh, over so soon. So cool, dude. I love this section. Rest in peace. Drake, you are not muted. I can see your message, bro. Right, let's try and keep as many elites alive as possible. Oh, off you go. My god, this that's an aggressive brute. Yeah, that that dialogue. Oh shit, no, 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 off you go. Not using that. There we go.
There we go. Oh, a fresh sword. Oh. No, you can, you're not having one either. Give me the brute shot. Oh, fucking hell. Give me the brute shot. You take your sword. Go on, miner. Take your sword. I'm just not going to use that. I'm going to have to find another weapon. There we go. Spinning coach, thanks for the five bucks, dude. If you could pull one weapon and vehicle from any Halo into real life, what would it be? I'd probably pull... Oh, shit. The fucking Zealot's I almost dead. Weapon. That cannot happen. Uh, I'd love a battle rifle, like a BR-55. Um, energy sword would be sick. Plasma rifle would be sick. Uh, a lot of choices. A lot of choices. Probably those two, though. Probably a, a BR. Uh, and then vehicle, longsword. Give me, give me my personal longsword. I'd be so happy with that. I'd live a very content life with my own longsword. And enough international airspace to fly it in. Although, to be fair, speeding down a highway in a ghost would be kind of sick. Oh, it's so painful not picking up brute shots, dude. I'm going to do it, though. Hey, thanks for the 10 bucks, Sentient Side. Do you think in a Halo Infinite they will explore the links between the two... Oh, between the two. Okay, between humanity and the Flood. Or they might tie in a fan theory with humanity being a parasitic race and the Flood is a diversion of evolution. Uh, no, because we know that the Floods are um, like the, the corrupted remains of the Precursors. So I, I doubt that would happen. If it did, it would be a massive retcon. Um, and I wouldn't be a fan of it personally. Uh, I mean, <laughs> you never know, but I don't think that would happen personally. Thank you very much for the 10 bucks, dude. I appreciate it. Sorry, I don't understand what you said before. What do you mean by the, the links between them? Um, because there never were any links between them before. Unless you mean something like, uh, I don't know, what they did to the genetics to try and, like, beat the Flood. How they, like, sacrificed a third of their population. My God. That brute shot is wrecking havoc. Bye. Wait, can you even... Hang on. Did that... Did that elite come through there? Can you actually go through there? No, I was going to say, that would have blown my mind if there were stairs there. I must have played this mission 200, 300 times. Oh, I like how he does that. He says... Gets that... Oh, he didn't say the prey. Normally gets down and says like a prayer for them or something. Pretty cool. A lot of brutes. Something cool I'd like to see in Infinite, if uh, if we do get elite allies in that game, would be... You know how when you get marines and it gives them names? Like, in Reach, you got like Sergeant Stacker and all the... And all the um... He's no more. And like, all the Bungie employees and stuff. It'd be cooler to do that, but for elites. Like, have loads of custom elite names and shit. Your journey's begun. Why are you still saying that? We know the great journey. Well, we don't. We don't know it's a lie yet. We're pretty sure it is. Arbiter's got a slight inkling that it might be. What do elites eat? Uh, meat. They go hunting. They bar They actually do barbecue meat. Um, that's a real fact. Elites do barbecue meat. Oh my god. Shit. Oh my god, that Grunt actually survived. We've had a lot of Grunt survive in this stream. I can't pick that up for some reason. There we go. Alright, the shotgun is definitely not a brute weapon. My favourite flood level. Um, Sacred Icon, I think. Uh, there you go, see the, the audio just clipped in. Sacred Icon is great. Right. Give me this ghost. <laughs> I 
I thought he survived that then. I was gonna say. Fucking hell. He survived that somehow. These brutes are literal tanks. Goodbye. Why do brutes like human weapons? This is the only like the shotgun, and I'm assuming it's because it's quite. I mean, when you think about it, it's quite a brute like weapon in a way. Very close quarters, very barbaric. So I can kind of see why they like it. Fits their style. Oh shit, sorry. <laughs> sorry, Grin. <laughs> Apologies for that. Had they somewhat changed the flood, changed the flood, but the flood being 100% precursor base, I feel like that part of that story needs to be fleshed out. I mean, we do know very little about that. All we know from that was from uh, like the stuff that the primordial, primordial said, and it's in, implicated quite a few times that you can't trust him exactly. So, um, you never know. I don't think I don't think it would be anything human though. I, I don't I don't personally see that happening. And if it were to happen, I wouldn't be the biggest fan of it, honestly. I, I wouldn't like that. The origin is of the Flood right now, even though it's kind of like, a, still like, a bit on edge. I do, I, I love it how it is right now. Any more changing it, I don't think is necessary, personally. Oh my god, I'm whiffing all my shots. There we go. It seems to sound really weird, but I love how the destroyed spectres look in this game. There's something about the way they look and the way they break up. Oh, shit. No! Save the brute. I'll oh, save the leap. Fuck. Fuck you, brute. The hell was that? Favorite Warthog run? Probably Halo 3s. Oh, actually, no, definitely Halo 3s. For sure. I love this section, just fucking babbling through a canyon. Oh god. You know what? They can stay there. <laughs> Slatterboard fast, thanks to the five bucks, dude. Have you noticed that the gameplay is horribly compressed audio in H2A? More so than any of the games released on PC so far. Um, it's, yeah, a little bit. Not much, but I have noticed it with the, the carbine in particular sound is a bit fucked. Like, the audio seems to peak too much. Um, yeah, like it has been heavily compressed in a way. I need oh my god. That guy would not die. Yeah, I do know what you mean, actually. Um, now that you say that. I'm stuck. <laughs> Thanks for the five bucks, dude. I appreciate it. Yeah, it's kind of annoying. This uh, this has a plethora of issues, and it shouldn't have released when it when it has done. Um, I mean, silver linings at least this time they didn't randomly release it. That was I don't know why they did that with CE. I, I don't understand. Maybe they were trying something that I I don't know about. Maybe, but I I don't know what they were doing with that. <laughs> Fuck me, dude. You fucking bruise. Oh, what the fuck is that shotgun range? My dude is using fucking smart scope or some dumb shit, dude. Uh, Noah, I, I want it personally. Just not to, I don't, I don't want it to replace any existing features. Um, I've said it before, it needs to be handled. Fuck me. It needs to be handled like uh, Modern Warfare has handled Warzone. Which in my opinion is the best battle royale yet. Uh, Halo 3 is coming first, then ODSD. Fucking hell. Right, hopefully that blows the ghost up and kills him. Right. That shotgun brute has, I believe... There he is. Jumped off the side. How kind of him. Oh my god. Right, you know what? I actually might camo this. Ha! 
Bye. Not gonna lie, I like it, but the Halo 2 shotgun is so, like, weak. Pacing for the anniversary needs to be fixed, and if they could fix the pacing in the cutscenes. Yeah, I noticed that as well, Scythe, actually. The, the HRA cutscenes seem to be lagging a little bit. And also, I mean, this has always been the case, but the, uh... The classic ones are, like, a bit behind. Splitting cook, splitting coats, thanks for the two bucks, dude. Crossbow and Warzone is super fun. I've actually not used it, apart from in, um, warm-ups. Jesus, dude, don't send me all the way back. Thank God. Yeah, I've not used it unless, uh, aside from in, um, in warm-ups. My go-to right now is the Growl, which is, like, what everyone's using. Um, fucking hell, three snipers. The Growl and a few other things. Um, AX-50, MP5, MP7... Striker, few things. Hey, Alex, thanks for the 10 bucks, dude. It must be nice not having to get up and go to the bathroom. You put like a spot at the special suit. Dude, who's <laughs> to say that I've not needed the bathroom for like, the past hour? I have them, but we're finishing it first. <laughs> thanks for the 10 bucks, dude. I appreciate it. I also want to go and get a drink, but uh, I just I want to finish this first. I'll go and do that when I finish the stream. God. How did that not pack smack? Oh, he just died. Lovely. Always confuses me why a ghost comes through here. Stupid brute. <laughs> yeah, thanks for the 10. Thanks for the 10, Alex. I'm going to go to the bathroom when, uh, when this is all finished. Oh, wow, he actually died. I did not expect that. Favorite Halo ship class? Honestly, I don't have one because I'm not massively into ships. I'd probably just say, like, just like a default Covenant Cruiser, like a CCS. I love it. It's fine, Zachary. Don't worry, dude. Don't worry, man. You don't have to donate at all. Spend his fart to salute you. Get the picture. I do. By the brutes. Vile. The prophets were fools to trust them. Yeah, if you want to go, if you want, if you want ships, go to Ak. Ak knows his stuff. He can smell you. Just invested a time. <laughs> oh my god, Trojan. Holy shit. What do I prefer, Coke or Dr. Pepper or Mountain Dew? Uh, Dr. Pepper. I'm not a massive fan of, like, fizzy drinks, but if I have to choose one, Dr. Pepper. Kevin Boo, thanks for the five bucks, dude. Just wondering if you can use your mouse and control at the same time. Uh, do you think people like me, like, using gyro aiming? I think you can do, yeah. I, I have done with games before, and I'm pretty sure you could here. Uh, there's no co-op matchmaking, Dragon. Where's Where is he going? going? Earth, the Vinny struggle started. And this time, nothing will be left behind. Yeah, the music here is fucking beautiful. That structure in the center of the city, it's a forerunner ship. The Anodyne the Spirit. is heading straight for it. If he leads the Covenant fleet to Earth, they won't stand a, a chance. You have to stop him. That brute has the index. And, and Miranda, Miranda and Johnson. Johnson. He can activate the ring. If he does, I'll detonate in Amberclad's reactor just like we did the Autumns. The Boom. blast will destroy this city and the ring. Not a very original plan, but we know it'll work. No, I don't want to chance a remote detonation. I need to stay here. That's such good cinematography. Seeing Cortana and his advisors is so sick. Coming in hot for me and I'm clad. Dude, H2A high charity. I mean, it looks sick anyway, but that is fucking beautiful. That is, like, beautiful. I do think, for some reason, in Amaclad looks objectively better in Classic, but this, fuck me. So nice, dude. Back in 
Hater 2 VR mod would be a dream. Actually, you know what? I'm going to take a... Oh, no. I don't need a shotgun yet, actually. Not yet. Oh! Now, that was a lunge. Goodbye. Would I rather be a brute or a jackal? Probably a brute. Yeah, get ready for the mannequin bio section. Baby. Wait for it. I agree, Daniel. I agree wholeheartedly. It's a dream. Shall we let the flood consume our holy city? Turn my charity into another very rich I believe it's like right here. After truth stops talking. Flood too shall fail. The flood too shall fail. Oh my god. Because Cortana is not a Covenant construct, not not even close. You love to hear it. Hey, Michael, th Michael, thanks for the ten bucks, dude. Infinite is bringing back more classic armor design and music, and I feel like people who might be taking Halo Five criticism and holding back from trying new things in favor of pandering. I disagree. I think all they've done is pivot their direction, and they're going to try new things, but in a classic direction. Personally. Um, I, my my personal issue with with uh, like Halo 5 and Halo 4 was not that they tried new things. It was the way they did them. It was how like, the style in which they did them. And I, I'm I'm convinced they'll still do new things, just in a more classic style, which to me is like perfect. Like I, I want new things. I don't want the same shit all over again. Um, <laughs> I want new shit, but I want it done in like a classic Halo style, which to me Halo 4 and 5 didn't, but Halo Infinite is looking to. Now, this is creepy. Yeah, actually, listen to how compressed the sound of the... That sounds really, really bad. The carbine in Anniversary, it sounds really compressed now you've mentioned it. Hmm. Strange. Definitely is compressed. It's like you can hear where the audio stops. Have I ever made a video about the Prophets? Uh, what in particular about them? I have made videos about them before. One thing I haven't covered yet is the Prelates. Which actually I might... Ooh, that's a good point. I might do that video soon. My god, that guy was going fast. Fucking hell. Now that Halo 2's out, I might make that video. It's been on my to make list for a while. It's cool as well that technically the Grave Mind, because obviously it's like the Primordial's essence, and also all the old Grave Mind's essence as well, knows about the San Shayum and the the prophets, and he knows of like that. Obviously, they have like a back, they have like a history. Really cool little attention to detail right there that you only you only get if you read the Fallen trilogy. And it's one of the things that 343 has improved about these games, like indirectly, but still improved. Let me try and get a sword cancel off this guy. There we go. What are prelates? Basically, um, prophets who aren't bound to gravity wheelchairs and are like extremely skilled fighters. There's a book called Shadow of Intent that was released a few years ago by Joe Staten that has Artas um, hunting them down. It's a really good book. Highly recommend it. Oh, shit. Right, you know what? You can... Give me that rocket launcher right now. I don't trust you. Oh, 
this together, together now. Two corpses in one grave. Apparently these are the prophet hierarchs. Should I do the jump? I don't even know if I can do. Oh yeah. Oh shit, no, I don't think I can. Fuck. Unless. Launch me. <laughs> nope. Not on this mission. How strong were ancient humans? Pretty much on par with the foreigners, who were extremely more powerful than anything in the current Halo universe. Uh, Elijah, yeah, Halo Wars. That was the only time that we know of. They, I'm pretty sure, I, I looked into this recently, so I was going to make a video on it. I'm pretty sure they knew about them, or they, they suspected their existence before Halo Wars, but they never confirmed them. Yeah, I, I will have mentioned the prolex before in a hard video, for sure. This crisis will oh, that was easy. be the end of us. It is but one last hurdle before the journey. It is but one last hurdle. Come on, open. Do I have to kill these Covenant first? Okay, now it's gonna open, I think. Oh my god! They're trying to kill me with crates! I've blocked the door with them. Oh my god. That's so cool. I love how, um... It was actually that room, wasn't it, where they have all the shards. There's a name for the room where they have all the shards from every every planet they've ever glassed. Like one shard per planet they've glassed. It's kind of cool. <laughs> Trying to be crazy. Fuck it up. <laughs> I've seen these terminals like a billion times. Uh, yeah. Welcome back, Mr. Beaver. We're not far from the end now. One mission. I knew the Covenant was good at repurposing Forerunner technology, but, but this is amazing. amazing. They've been using the Forerunner ship's engines as an energy source for the city. The high IQ Covenant play. From high power grid. Stopping there we go. Take it serious. Welcome to the stream, dude. Greetings from Greece. God damn. Welcome, man. Thanks for stopping by. I love Greece. I really, really want to go back when, obviously, the whole COVID situation is done. Chief, when you get to Earth, good luck. After I'm through with truth. Now make a girl a promise. If you know you can't keep it. <laughs> that cinematography is fucking incredible, dude. Blur absolutely killed these cutscenes. They are so good. Here we go. This is an extremely underrated mission, actually. I love the Great Journey. This is a fucking fantastic mission. Big fan. Big fan. Mr. Cortana, though. Yeah, I only went for the Didact one. What is that place? PS1 Hagrid. Where the counselors were meant to watch the consecration of the icon. What a beautiful cutscene. Indeed, Mr. Coax. Thanks for the two bucks, deed. Indeed. It is still time to stop the key from turning. I must get inside. Then, then mount up, Arbiter. I know, I know a way, way to, to break, break those doors. I hope so, Daniel. That would be sick if it was true. Thank you for your wraith, Artas. How kind of you. God, this, the difference here is massive. I love how both look, honestly. I love the, like, grey beaches of, of Classic, but I also love the vibrant, grassy plains of Anniversary. Now, this is an underrated mission. Massively. You never hear, really hear anyone talk about Great Journey. Aww. I will say, the visibility is a lot better on Classic. Like, the... The one thing that I like from a visual standpoint, but from like a gameplay standpoint, I'm not a massive fan of, is how cluttered H2A is. 
it makes it look fucking beautiful, but from a gameplay perspective, sometimes it can be a bit much, I think. Will they bring back classic Arbor to an infinite? No idea. I wish I knew the answer to that question. I really do. <laughs> oh my god, that ghost just fucking get down Mr. President Presidented that three. Get down, Mr. President. Ooh, almost. Halo 2 has the most satisfying vehicle destruction physics. And effects. And sound effects. Yeah, I agree, Christian, for sure. HOA can be way too dark in some areas. Um, it's like the opposite of the issue that they have with CEA, where CEA was too bright in some areas. It ruined the atmosphere. This is the opposite. This is too dark in some areas. Like, not even so dark that it adds to the atmosphere. It's just, just like, too dark. Oh, classic H2 Wraith sounds so much better than the H2A1. So much better. Bye. <laughs> the elites have come to our raid, Arbiter. They will fight by our side. Or the hunters, not Elise. I thought he was dead. Such a good section, I love that. Then we'll fight by our side. Come on, fellas. Storm the keep. Michael, thanks for the T-Bucks, dude. Who read it animation? Ooh, that's a good question. Probably Halo 2 BR, I'd say. I love the Halo 2 BRs. I also love the Halo Combat Evolved Assault Rifles as well. Halo Forest Magnum is also very good. Oh god. I need a weapon. I love watching the hunters and brutes just completely go at it here. Of course having the hunters win. <laughs> Goodbye. Okay, right, I'm allowed to use brute weapons on this mission. I hope so. Uh yeah, I hope we do. I really hope we do. Ah, stuck. God, this is just fucking carnage. Like, this area, I think, is a, a bit too dark. It looks really nice in anniversary. It's just a bit too dark. Yo, yo. Away with you. Oh my god. Oh no, I'm one health dying. Holy shit. I don't understand what those things are that blow up. They look like they look like chairs or something. I've always been confused what they actually are. Oh that was a bit of a stutter there. One second. What is that brute doing? <laughs> what are you taking cover behind? Oh. Have you tried Halo 2 speedrunning? I have. Um, so when MCC first came out in 2014, I was the first in the world for the time for Arbiter on Easy. I had the fastest time in the world um, for like like a month or two. And then Mr. Monopoly, who's like the Halo 2 speedrunner, um, came and beat it like by about 13 seconds. I thought I had the time. I, I thought I'd shaved like all the time off it as possible. 
and then Monopoly comes in and beats it by 13 seconds. Where are the hunters? The hunters aren't... What the f... They got both the hunters? Holy shit. Oh my god. <laughs> well, okay, we'll continue this on our own then. My god. You know what? <laughs> we'll forget about the drones. Forget about them. Only the strong survive. Anything below here? Negative. Right. You don't. If you don't free the hunters at the start of this, you're not playing the mission, right? Oh no, don't run to the need. No hunter. Get the counselors out. Um, that's it. There's a terminal up there, but I'm not going to get it because I don't, I don't really need it. This section here is like, like pinnacle Halo 2 to me. This is just peak Halo 2. I love this section so much. Hey Dylan, thanks for the five bucks, dude. Uh, Jeff Keighley teased Halo Infinite news at his Summerfest event that is happening in two weeks. Wait, what? Really? Oh, shit. Okay. Was that today? Was that, was that during the I need a weapon. Unreal thing? Holy fuck. If that's true, that's pretty big. I'll check Twitter when we finish when we finish this mission, uh, Dylan. That's massive if true. Chad Hunters. That's... Oh, God, I hope so. Nope. Oh my God, that guy just... That brute just threw his plasma... His, his plasma off of that, like, a lot. Is that... Oh, he's got a Jonathan hat on. You're creeping me out, sir. <laughs> You're creeping me out, sir. Don't like you, but if we don't do something, Mr. Mohawk's gonna have to make this ready. And we're all gonna die. Is it worth getting now? Yeah, it's buggy, don't get me wrong, but it's, I mean, you can get each game for like, I think, $10, so it's kind of worth it, I'd say. Right, where's that beam rifle? There's a beam rifle, uh, there it is. Need that for the Taurus fight. Take my Banshee, Orbiter. Thank you, Chad. Now, this is a cool section. Final level, indeed. We'll go and get the... Uh, I forget which doll it is. There's a doll on top of the control room tower. We'll go and get it. Whilst you're waiting for Jonathan to crawl around in his scarab. Ah, how, do you like it? how do you like it? Oh, I love that sound. Classic Fuhrer design, or sound even, is, is the best. Jonathan, <laughs> he's still down there. Oh my god. Go, Mum. You are our prophet. Thank you very much. Not quite a prophet, but I'll take it. No. Okay. 
Uh, I have fun time gamer. And let me tell you that it's not a fun time. It doesn't end well. Not at all. Oh. <laughs> and it's even worse than that. My god, that Banshee eat. There's a spectre down there. Yeah, Marty, Marty did incredible work with Healer 2s. Oh, shit. His finest work, if you ask me. Right, there's... Another banshee round here somewhere, I think. Is that Wraith still flipped over? <laughs> yeah, it is. The fucking weaponless brute. There he is. Hello. <laughs> Look at that for an ominous swagger walk. Look at that. Oh, please don't stand on my banshee. Phew. Stand back. Oh my god, fucking banshee. <laughs> knock, knock. Knock, knock. Go on, find the beam. Oh, almost. That is a tough door. That is a very tough door. There we go. Okay, so much for the doll. He's this what only brute we can't kill. Can't bring myself to do it. <laughs> That's one way to make an entry. I do normally like camoing this section. Oh shit. But uh not today, and I should be saving that actually for you some old tartar tartar sauce. There we go. Oh my god, I forgot about them. I'm pretty sure this is the only time that you fight brute on the guards, isn't it? I wanna say this is the only time. What the fuck? Bruh. Alright, let's stealth up. <gasps> Where is he? Oh my god, I missed it. There's no escape, apart from death. Oh my god. Oh god. Yike. One single yike. Oh my god. I'm bad and bruised here. That's another one. Now just the iron guards. That was a lot of whiff shots right there. What are you doing? What are you attacking? You know what, I'm just gonna put you out of your misery. <laughs> okay, here we go. We are of culture for playing this game, we are indeed. Here we go. I didn't do the Jonathan glitch though, unfortunately. But, we don't need it. Come where you live, it is easy. Take the icon in your hands. And do as you are told. 
Please use caution. This reclaimer is delicate. One more word, Oracle, and I'll rip your eye from its socket. <clears throat> Which is nothing compared to what I'll do to you. Yikes. Tartarus, stop. Tartarus. Impossible. Put down the icon. Put it down. And disobey the Hierarchs? There are things about Halo even the Hierarchs do not understand. <laughs> Take care, Arbiter. What you say is heresy. Is it? is it? Oracle, what is Halo's purpose? Collective oh. Oh. The seven. Oh. Another oh. word. Please. Don't shake the light bulb. If you want to keep your brain inside your head, I tell those boys to chill. Go ahead. Do your thing. The sacred rings. What are they? Weapons of last resort, built by the forerunners to eliminate potential flood hosts, thereby rendering the parasite harmless. And those who made the rings? What happened to the forerunners? After exhausting every other strategic option, my creators activated the rings. Rip. And all additional sentient life in three radii of the galactic center died as planned. Would you Tartarus. Like to see the relevant data? Tartarus. The prophets have betrayed us. Not another word. <laughs> no that would hurt. The great journey has been hey, thanks for the T-Bucks, Cokes. Have I seen Donkey Killer videos? No, I need to watch them. I need to watch Donkey Killer videos. I've been watching Donkey for years. Back from when he used to do uh, League videos. So I need to catch up. Best moment. Yeah, I love that moment. That music there is really sick as well. God, the the I'm so happy that the concept art that was made for this map w wasn't used. Um, there's this concept art for this like little map here, this arena, that was made for H2A where it was all like Halo 5. This entire platform was, and room was like Halo 5, Foreigner design. And I'm not going to lie, it looked fucking awful. I'm so happy they didn't go with it. This one looks so much nicer. Come on, Jonathan. Hit him hard. Oh, he's about to die. This is going to be a quick kill, this is. I do wish we could use the Fist of Rooked, honestly. Jonathan. Oh. Go on, Jonathan. Let's super combine him. See if that does anything. Killed by a needler. Embarrassing. Embarrassing. And there you go. Almost. Not keen on this version. The choir sounds so much better in classic. Sounds a bit too overdone in, in new. <laughs> For its greatest weakness, the needler. Exactly. John said that looks so weird. Installations. Show me. Fail sync protocol. In the event of unexpected shutdown, the entire system will move to standby status. All remaining platforms are now ready for remote activation. Uh oh. Remote activation from here. Don't be ridiculous. Listen, Tinkerbell. Don't, don't make, make me. me. John's face Where there. Where someone go to activate the other rings? Why the Ark? Of course. And where Oracle is that? <laughs> Now that is an alliance. 
That is an alliance. We've got a new contact. Unknown classification. It isn't one of ours. Take it out. This is Spartan 117. Anyone hear me? Over. Isolate that signal. Master Chief, <laughs> you mind telling me what you're doing on that ship? Sir, finishing this fight. There it is. There it is. I love that little bit of right there. That little bit of music is like the most nostalgic Halo Halo music for me for some reason. That fucking takes me back. And here we go. Running that blue shit up exactly. Silence fills the empty grave. Now that I am gone. Mind is not at rest. Logic playing time. Ramirez! I will ask and you will answer. Thank you, Daniel. I appreciate it. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Alright. Shoot. Shoot. Do it, do it, great man. Shoot. Shoot. So uh That's it, fellas. Halo 2. Actually, only one crash. Um, internet only went down once. So you know what? I'd say that was a pretty good stream overall. <laughs> I was expecting it to be a lot worse than that. Both in terms of my internet and the game, but thankfully it's not. Um, yeah, thank you for stopping by, fellas. I'm going to call it quits there because I need to go and get a drink really badly. Um, yeah, I'm glad you guys enjoyed the stream. Halo 2 campaign plays a lot better than I thought it would do. Pleasantly surprised. Uh, pleasantly surprised. So, fellas, thank you for stopping by. Thank you very much for all the donations. I got all of them on the stream. Um, let me just check real quick Jeff Keeley's Twitter. Uh, uh, where is Jeff Keeley? Did he just say anything about Infinite? Michael, thanks for the 10 bucks, dude. Had a great time with the stream. Shout out to all the Halo YouTubers I love. Initialization 00, zero Actman, Eckhart, General Kid, Late Night Gaming, and of course you, <laughs> love you all. Thank you very much, man. Thank you very much for all the support of this stream, dude. I really do appreciate it. You're a legend. You're a legend. Thank you very much, man. Thank you. Uh, let me see if I've missed anything. Who's next? That's what you get when you mess with the spot. Uh, I can't find anything. Uh, oh, you mean the trailer we put out? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I knew about that. I thought, because I know we had um, a show today where they revealed Unreal Engine 5. I wasn't sure if that was... Um, I wasn't sure if he said something during that. Uh, obviously not, though. Right, let me uh, see if Uber Nicholas is streaming. He's not. Uh, nobody's streaming that can go and host. So, uh, yeah, with that said, uh, I'm going to end the stream there, guys. Thank you again for stopping by. I really appreciate it. All of you, as per usual, uh, it's a fun time. Going to do more streams over here on YouTube in the future with Halo 2. Because, I mean, how could I not? But yeah, uh, I'm going to get a fucking drink. <laughs> uh, yeah, thanks for my guys. Stay in coach. Thanks, thanks for the five bucks, dude. I appreciate it. What Michael said. Awesome stream, man. Libby channel. Thank you very much, dude. I appreciate it. Thank you to you and Michael uh, and Coach and everyone else. Everyone else for the... Uh, Koto and everyone else for the donations and the, the chat and everything. I really appreciate it. Yeah. Uh, see you guys in a bit. Thanks for stopping by. And I'll see you in my next video on Saturday or Sunday. One of the two. <laughs>